you're going already. Oh yes, I want to get to the market first to buy some things before I get to my shop. Ah. Uh, okay. Uh, but how far now? I hope you've not forgotten. Forgotten what? Wait, when are you going back to school? I'm going back on Wednesday now. I told you yesterday. Uh, you told me yesterday? Yes, now. I can't remember you telling me anything yesterday. Uh, how could you have forgotten now? I told you now. I, I needed money to sort some things in school. Uh, I told you now. It's okay. It's not a problem. Let me just go to the market. When I come back, we'll talk, eh? Okay, all right. Let me go. I'm already late. When I come, we'll talk, eh? Okay, bye. Bye, do well, eh? <laughs> sir, you're welcome, sir. Ah, uh, how are you? I'm fine, sir. Mm. So, how is business? Ah, business is fine, oh, mm. we thank God. <laughs> um, Adugo, I came in respect of what I have been telling you. I, I want you to accept me. I promise I will make you happy. You see, in this community, there are so many girls, so many. But each time I set my eyes on you, your beautiful face melts my heart. I, I, I don't know why you hate me this much. Just give me an opportunity to love you. Huh. Please, don't use the word hate. That is a very strong word. I cannot hate anybody. And I, I don't hate you. The thing is that I, I, I don't have a boyfriend. And I haven't done it before. So... I don't want anything that will disturb me, so I just want to focus on my business. That is all about it. Wait a minute. You just said something that sounds so ridiculous. What? That you don't have a boyfriend. Yes. And you don't even intend to have one. Then what makes you happy? <laughs> you really want to know what makes me happy? Of course. I'll tell you. Okay. My business. That is number one. Number two is my brother's education. Oh. So you can see, it is not only when one is in a relationship that the person can be happy. So, what should I do? Go home and rest. Better still, just just look around this village. There are a lot of beautiful girls. Just choose one. Oh. Please, just, just leave me alone. I do go. Please. I do go. I will never, ever leave you alone. You are my choice. I will never leave you until you say yes. Of course, I know there are beautiful girls in this community. But you are my choice. All right, I'll see you again. told me yesterday but honestly I've forgotten what 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 was that what was that yeah, it's about things I have to do in school now you know these are our lecturers they become very very wicked yes so if you don't buy their handouts or you don't buy their textbooks mm -hmm. they will fail you no matter how intelligent you are so I need to buy textbooks so I need to buy my remaining handouts and for some of them who have advanced to online assignments uh, I have to repair my laptop so all these things you're talking about, like how much um, do you need for it? Yes, uh, just 74,000 
Chicken. Yes, sister. Did you just say 74,000 naira is just? Where do you expect me to get that kind of money from? Eh? Chike, you know my small provision shop is not making as much money as you think. Ah, and you're just telling me 74,000 naira is just. Chike, it's not just though. Sister, you're the one who said I should concentrate on my studies now. I said I wanted to learn photography, you know, to be, uh, uh, you know, helping me out in school. You said no. I said I wanted to, you know, bar people's hair. You said no. You said I should just concentrate on my studies. I, I mean, ah, so what, what will I do now? I, I need this to pass. This, these are wicked lecturers. I'm sorry, but I just need the money, please. You know what? I'll try and see what I can, I can raise for you. You know, go. Thank you. But Chike, please, whatever I am able to raise for you, just try and be prudent with it. Oh, you have seen everything now. It's only me. No other person is helping us because you are no. Oh. No problem. I know now. I know you're the only person helping me out. But please, I just need to do this thing so I can graduate. Uh, please. No, no, I, I, don't talk, I don't talk. Do you know that? If you know the distance I trek from school to where I, to my hostel, I don't take a I don't take bike. I don't, don't want to tell you all these things because it's I don't okay. want to. Don't, don't worry, it's okay. It's okay, Nugo. Um, I'll just run around and see what I can raise. It's okay, but you know I'll do anything for you now. No, I just wish you just let me start this babbing no, thing. Don't now. worry. Chike, you are my all. I I don't have any other thing in this world. And I don't want you to be distracted in school. So just don't worry. I'll I'll run around and see what I can raise. Hmm? Oh yeah, come on. Do you want to eat? No, I'm fine. Are you sure? I'm fine. You don't, you don't want me? No, I'm fine. You can enjoy it. No problem. I just sent the clothes now. Ah, I've already ordered now. Don't be wasting my time. Ah, my baby doesn't like time wasting. Please. Um, when tomorrow, we will get the clothes tomorrow. Uh, fast and sharp, fast and sharp. Don't waste our time. Don't waste our time. Okay. Uh -huh. Please, 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 please. We have a party to attend. Okay now. All right. Okay. Baby, okay. send tomorrow, eh? Okay. Because I want my baby to look sharp. Of course. Sharp. <laughs> yeah. So, um, this is what's up, eh? When? Guy, what's going happen now? This one really do face like weapon. What's going happen? Guy, shark now. Shark. Money day now. Shark. Shark. Enjoy. Shark. Ah. No fear. Bad day. Baby, don't worry now. Mm, Leave bad him. Day. Maybe, bad day. maybe he's not in the mood to take something. He's old enough to decide when he wants to take something. Oh? Nah, don't worry now. Nah. <laughs> you take your baby, your girlfriend don't serve you breakfast. Yeah? <laughs> Come yeah, on. Relax, <laughs> nah. Ah. Yeah. Hey, hey, baby, um, it's about that money I asked you. So use and fix my other phone. Oh, you know, yeah. I haven't been online. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. When I used to browse. Yeah, that your other phone you yeah. said you used to browse. Okay, okay, all right. Because my baby gotta keep browsing. Okay, how much, <laughs> how much, how much? How much? Mm, it's just 20,000 naira. The repairer said 20,000 naira. Yes. Are you sure it's a good repairer? Mm hmm. You're sure? Yes. Okay, no, 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 why you, no, why you, no, why you, no, why you. I'll give you. I'm the talk and do guy. Talk and do guy. A baby should keep having her phone. She should yes, keep communicating, baby. you know? <laughs> 20,000, because my baby got to keep communicating, yes, you baby. know? That's what's up. That's the shiznit. Yeah, yeah. So that's twenty thousand. You can even add more. No, baby. I'm just gonna top it up. Top it up. <laughs> just like you know, just just one. Okay. okay. Yeah. That's twenty five. Okay. So this is exactly twenty thousand five hundred. Twenty five. <laughs> Thank you so much, baby. Twenty five. Thank you, baby. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the thing is this, eh? Ah. Uh, 
Guy. Guy. What's wrong with him? Baby, just leave him. Let's focus on our hang out. There's something wrong. Eh? My guy, there's something wrong with my guy. Mm. I'll be back. I'll be back. Yeah, I'll be back. Guy! Guy! Guy, what did they talk now? What did happen now? Ah, uh -uh. which kind of display that one now? Which, wait, 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 what did you say you do now? You didn't drink. You, you, you just walked out like that. On to waiting now. Chicky, do you know you're a fool? You say, Chicky, you be fool. Ah, uh, Chicky, you are a big fool. Why, why, why do you want me to drink? Sit and drink with you for what? When Sister Hadugo is suffering in the village, sending you money and you're spoiling that stupid brat. You, you you called your girlfriend. You are a big fool. Come, guy, guy. I don't I don't I don't understand you. I don't understand you. Ah, what do you mean? Which one is that I'm a fool now? Well, I don't understand. Are you not a fool? Chike, tell me. Are you not a fool? Ah, what do you do with all the money Sister Dogo sent to you? You keep what? spending it on joy. Why? Don't you have conscience? Don't you have conscience? Has Sister Dugo not suffered enough for your sake? Has she not? How do you think she will feel if she finds out you're messing up and messing around with the money she, she sends to you? Uh, uh, wait, 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 So what's your business with how she will feel if she finds out how I spend the money she gives me? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Chike, you she, are I beg, stop her. She has given me money. She has given me money. So how I spend it shouldn't be her business or your own business. You understand yeah. me? Because she can never know. Yes. Abi. Yes. Not be my business. Not be your business. You guy. be fool now. Nah. Don't call me that thing. Guy. You see the way I say be fool. Guy, call me that you thing. be mumu. Say, no, call me that mugu. Thing. No, call me that thing. You be mugu. Chike. Chike. Chike, how many times I call you? I bet, guy, I know the mathematics class. I know the maths class. What's in happen? What's in the play? Abi now. Eh, what's in happen? Abi. What's in happen? You see the way you be mugu. Don't call me that thing now. Nah. You be mumu now. Nah. You be mumu, guy, Chike. No you go be. Can you imagine? Is it not poor? Paul? It's Paul now. What did he do? Can, can you imagine Paul telling me that you're not the girl for me? No, no, okay, look, look at this sex now. Just, just, just look at Look at Paul telling me you're not the girl for me. That Why should I be spending money on you? Why should I be buying drinks for you? Why should I be giving you money? For what now? <laughs> Paul. Anyways, I know why he's doing all that. I know. Why? Can you imagine that Paul asked me out? I said I should be his girlfriend, I should leave you and date him. Eh? Yes. Paul. Paul. Yes, he's been disturbing me that I should be his girlfriend, I should leave you and date him. I refuse. Paul asked you out? Yes, baby. He, he, he's jealous that I'm dating you. He asked me to leave no. you and date him. Oh, hold on. Paul, my friend, asked you out. Yes, baby. I'm not lying. And I told him I cannot cheat on you. Paul. Paul did that. Yes. Yes, baby, you know I cannot lie to you. Paul! So don't worry, baby. I'll, I'll handle him, trust me. Paul! Calm down, baby. I'll, I'll no, 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 no. Ah, wait, <laughs> Paul! Baby, I said I'll handle him. Hmm. Relax. Hmm? Hmm. 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 Who am I saying? Oh. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. How are you? I'm fine. Good to see you. Good to see you too. You're looking good, sir. Oh, please. Thank you. How are you? I'm fine. How is school fine. now? Thank God. Ah, it's fine. like you're here for a weekend. Oh, yes. Aww. Oh, yes, sister. So good to have you. Thank so, you. Thank you. How is my brother, Chike, your best friend? How is he doing? Chike. Uh, sister, honestly, I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know Chiki's where about. We're not friends any longer. No, sorry. I'm sorry. Like, I don't understand what you mean by you don't know. Are you no longer in the same school? Sister, we are, but uh -huh. we... I, I don't know Chiki's where about. He... We're no longer friends. He acts strange, so I have to walk away. No, wait now. I, maybe we are getting it all mixed up. I mean Chike, my, my brother, who is also your best friend. Sister, I know a lot happened. A lot. But celebrate her birthday, lavish money on her, buys beautiful 
big expensive stuffs for her. I confronted him as my friend. I told Chike. Chike embarrassed me. Chike refused to listen to me. Instead, Chike went to that stupid girl and told her everything I told him. And then, they were together. I came to visit Chike. The girl threatened me, insulted me. In his presence, old sister, in his presence. Sister, I was expecting Chike to tell the girl not to speak to me in that manner. But instead, Chike counted 20,000 naira and gave to the girl. What? <laughs> That, that, that no, made me so, look so stupid and I had to walk away. I'm so sorry I'm laughing because what you're saying is actually funny. You're talking as if you're referring to another person that is not my brother. See, the chick I know will not do such a thing. Count how much, 20,000 and give to a girl. From where, Kwan? Chike cannot do that. I, I, I know my brother. Oma Memoya. Sister, Chike is no longer the Chike we know. Not to the extent of giving a girl money. Ah ah, Chike knows what I've been suffering to, to raise money. It's not, it's not possible. Paul. Sister Chike has not given that girl more. The 20,000 is just the one I saw. He has given her more. He buys her things. Sister, Ch Chike is irredeemable right now. And if you doubt me, call Chike. Tell him that I, Paul, his friend, told you everything. I'm not scared of him. Tell him that I told you. Sister, I have to, I have to get going. I'm so sorry. But this Paul, I know him to be a boy that um, doesn't just talk anyhow. So there must be sense in what he's saying. But no, now. Chike cannot do it. I don't want to believe what they told me is real. I don't want to believe what they told me is true. Oh, one day more, I can't even love Chike, one day more, I can't no one more, mama. I would like to see you tomorrow. Yes, here in the village. I Chike, don't worry. When you come here, I'll tell you what the problem is. Yes. Okay. Just for you to make me. Give me the reiki. When I want you to make your key. I see one day more. I don't want to believe what they told me is real. I don't want to believe that the rumor is true. Ah, Chike, you're back. I'm back. Oh. Welcome. Yeah. This one you ordered me to come back from school to see you. I hope there's no problem. There's no problem at all. Are you sure? I'm sure, Chike. Just go inside here. Keep your bags. Let me just make food for you to eat. After which we'll talk. You know, go. 
No sure, there's no problem. There is no problem. Just go inside. Rest, eh? Let me just make something. Who is who? I don't understand. I mean, who is Joy? Joy? Yes. Ah. That all is with Joy. There are plenty of Joy now. Uh, joy, Joy, plenty. Joy. We are in the village. There are lots of joy. Joy outside. Joy in my school too. Lots of joy now. So we joy again. Don't even pretend as if you don't know the joy I'm talking about. Joy I now? Mean, yes, I mean joy, your girlfriend. Huh? Yes. Yeah. Oh yes. The one you have been taking out and spending the money I sent to you for important things. Yes. Huh? I mean joy, the one you dash. 20,000. Jesus! 20,000! Jesus! Jesus! 20,000 now! How? Chiki, what has come over you? Eh? I suffer so hard to, to raise this money that I sent to you just to make you happy in school. Just look at this. Our parents are dead. Living just the both of us. And I have been struggling, doing all manner of jobs. Just to make sure that you go to school. I've been doing all kinds of jobs that not even all men can do. Just to make sure that you graduate. Because, because I know if you're comfortable, I will be comfortable too. But hey, how did you pay me back? To give my hard earned money to another girl. Chike, 20,000 to another girl. Why? Sister, stop this thing. Sister, 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 stop, stop, stop this thing. Stop, stop this thing. You're breaking my heart. Stop, stop this thing now. What you mean, me give you twenty thousand now for what now? Sister, don't, don't. What kind of thing is this now? I, I know where all this is coming from. Oh, I know, I know. You don't need to tell me, but I know. It's poor now. Paul has come to the village to come and tell you all nonsense. Me give girl twenty thousand now. How? How will I give girl twenty thousand now for what? Paul has come to tell you this thing because he, he, he knew how much you gave me. I told him. I told him you gave me 20,000 naira and the next thing he asked me to, to give him uh, uh, 10,000 naira. That I should lend him 10,000 naira that he will give me back. And I said no. This money is my sister gave me. I'm using to survive. The next thing he, he now started avoiding me. And I said, ah, ah, Paul, why are you avoiding me now? He now said uh, he cannot be friends with somebody who doesn't care about his welfare. That's it too. And he now keeps going, 20,000, Paul. We can, what kind of thing? I'll give girl 20,000 for what? Chiki. Chiki. Sister. So you mean all these things that Paul told me, they are all lies? They are all lies now. They are all lies. They are all lies. This is spinning me. This is all lies. All lies. Now, oh God, Paul, eh? Okay, you see, you see, you see the joy. See this joy. This, 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 my girl, this is my friend, Joy. Now, Joy is somebody that she's very intelligent she's in my class. So we always do research together. We know we are in the same team. Yes, yes. Oh, wait, wait, let me ask you. Is she just your friend? Is she just a friend? Just She's a just a friend now. She's just a friend. Which one is girlfriend again? Ah, She's just a friend. She's a very focused girl. Very focused, good girl from good homo. Very focused girl. And that's why I chose her. To, to me and her just do the research. In fact, it's the lecture that put us together. Now, moving on. This joy now. Uh, this 20,000 naira happens to be money that her brother sent her to repair her phone. Then she we now went to ATM to go and withdraw the money. She didn't have a bag with her. She now said I should hold the money for her. So when we now went uh, to the cafeteria to eat, Joy now uh, 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 um, um, uh, 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 after eating, you understand me? Uh -huh. Then she now we now drank mineral. Then while we're drinking uh, mineral, the mineral she was even the one who paid. Though. You know, Paul was there. She paid for three of us. Then next thing Paul said uh, that, that he wants to drink beer. Joy now said no now that uh, I don't drink. She doesn't drink. So why why will he why would she pay for beer? Then that's how Joy became Paul's enemy. Paul's there carrying face for Joy. That, that's that's he hates Joy because Joy says she doesn't drink, I don't drink. So why will he drink beer? Mm. That's the problem. Hmm. Chike. Sister? Chike. Sister? Chike. Sister, stop this thing now. How many times did I call you? Sister, stop, please. Uh, no, after 
me now. How many times now? Stop, 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 stop this thing. I just hope all these things you're telling me, they are not lies. Hey, 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 hey. Because even you, I don't even understand you again. You know, since you went to school, you have changed. You now paint your baby. See, see the color of your baby. See, see. You sad your, your jeans. Look at your face. The way you're even wearing it, you turn it Sister, to the back. Sister, stop this thing now. GK. How will you be keeping malice with our guy? Stick with the quarrel with him. What's up? Your guy don't tell you what he do. So if you ask me to your guy do first now before you did, start to tell me all this one way you tell me now. I, I don't understand. What do you mean? Why didn't he tell you what he did? Why would your guy Paul say I should not roll with my girl? Why you talk that kind of thing? For what now? Until why? But he told you the truth now. What kind of truth? The guy tell you the truth. What kind now? of truth is that now? What kind of truth? That the girl is not good for you. She's not good for you. Can't you open your eyes? Can't you open your eyes when you see things now. What's up? Why they behave like this? Don't go there. What I make you so go, go into your eyes? Guys, so. see, see, see. You, you, th you, you, you think I don't know what in the world happened? I don't. Understand. You think I don't know what has happened? What has happened? Is no. I know that you and your guy have toasted my girl before. I know, it's and right? now I'm rolling with the girl. It's in the paper body now. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Pay when you talk, it's you people that I'm dating Joy. That's what's up. She's guy, dated my girl. Guy, 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 guy. Don't even say that. Don't even go there at all. I shouldn't say that. Which guy want to be said? We don't. We don't want those my girl. Until working now. Until until say that until now. She don't grieve for now. Now the girl they roll with me. It's in the paper body now. Uh huh. Now don't claim me say you don't even know what you did. Okay, let me. Ask. As big as you are, you're still a virgin. Okay. And what if what if I say that I want to marry you? Marry me. Mm -hmm. Please can you stop? I know you're not serious. I know you you're, you're just saying this because you want to have my body. I do. But no, I'm not I'm not going to buy that. Mm -mm, I won't. Mm -mm. On the contrary, I am I am that serious. Just say yes to me and trust me. I'll come with my kinsmen for official introduction. Are you really serious? Of course I am. Okay. I'll think about it and, and get back to you. It's okay. But I have to go now. People are waiting for me at the shop. Oh, no, hold on, hold on. Let me drop you off. Drop me? Ah, no, please. You know this is our village now. I don't want people to be seeing both of us. Before you know it, they will start talking. I do go. I am your husband to be. Husband to be? When I've not even said yes to you. Please don't worry. We'll talk some other time. Please. Thank you.
much, baby. I enjoyed the outing. I'm so happy. You like it? <laughs> like? Like is an understatement. I loved every bit of it. Wow. <laughs> I'm happy you do. <laughs> yeah. Well, uh, anyways, um, there are better places in this town that I will take you to. And you're going to love it. I promised you I was going to spoil you, right? <laughs> but you're doing that already. You're over spoiling me. <laughs> yeah, and your bundu. <laughs> so spoil me, baby. There's no problem with that, baby. Yeah. You know what? Um, I'm just going to do everything possible to just make you happy. But please, make sure you're not cheating on me with any guy. Huh? <laughs> Come on, baby. You know I wouldn't do that. Eh? Why would I cheat on you? <laughs> I'm not seeing any man, no. Hmm? You sure? <laughs> Another man. No way. It's you or never. Thank you so much. You know I love you, baby. <laughs> Come here, babe. <laughs> oh my God. Where are you going to? I almost got into the gutter. <laughs> where, where, um, where, where do you say I should drop you off again? Okay, just that supermarket down there before the school premises. Okay. Yeah, okay. I want to get some, some things like... Groceries here? Okay, groceries okay. and some other stuff, toiletries. Well, I, I'll do that, but I, I'm sorry I won't be able to take you from there back home. You know, I, I have an appointment that I'm rushing to, and I don't want to be late. It's fine, baby, I understand. Trust me, I do. Just drop me off, rush off for your appointment. I'll, I'll take a cab back to the school. Alright, I'll, I'll transfer the money for the cab for you. Is that okay? Oh, baby, you're so sweet. You're more sweeter. Can't you see that you're beautiful? You are sexy. Thank you, baby. Like, well, I'm beautiful. That's why you just me. I don't want to share you with anybody. Like, I just want to be the only man having all this, having a good taste of you. Come on, baby. You are already. <laughs> you have a good body figure, yeah, you know? Thank you, baby. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. All right, baby. So, let me... Here, right? Yeah, just here. Okay, okay. Let me... Find a way let, to let clear me, off the room. Let me clear properly, yeah? Yeah, exactly. Okay. We're here, babe. Yes. Thank you. All right. Take care. I'll you see know. you soon, baby. I know. Kiss me. Of course, I will. You. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I love you. Yeah. Take care. say I'm confused. He says he wants to marry me. How true could this be? No. I will not give him the chance because men are not to be trusted. I know he's only after my body and immediately he gets it. He will dump me. I don't even have the strength to fight him. No, 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 baby me. I went to your hostel. I didn't see you. I called your number. It was off. I don't understand. What's going on now? What's, your two numbers, they were off. What's happening? Yes, baby. I went to see my sister. Sorry I didn't tell you before I left, but my phone is still having issues. Sometimes it just goes off without me turning it off. And when I remember to turn it on, I just get busy with one or two things. This one is still giving me issues. So this... I met somebody who says she has somebody who can fix it once and for all, but it's only going to cost a little more money. And how much? I, I, I can't say. I wouldn't know until I get there. Joy, 
See, this your story is not adding up. I'm telling you, it's not adding up because I don't understand. What, what, are, you, what are you talking about? You told me about this repairer, and then I gave you money. You said you trusted him. Now you, the same phone is bad. The other one switched off. I don't understand what is really going on. Tell me what's going on. Are you seeing another person? No, because I'm saying hearing one or two things. But have you? Are you seeing another person? Because a girl starts lying like this. Me join. Oh, no, no, no. There are too many stories. There might be somebody involved. So what's going on? Tell me. I'm not seeing anybody. I'm not seeing anyone else. If you're tired of this relationship, why don't you just tell me instead of laying false accusation on me? I will just walk away. But bear in mind that you will bear the consequences if anything happens to me because I will just kill myself. No, no, it's okay. It's okay. Don't talk about you killing yourself. It's okay. It's okay. It's just that I, 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 I can't stand, you know, you dating another person. If you're for me, you be for me. That's it. That's it. Yes, baby, I'm, I'm not seeing another person. It's just you forever. It's just you and I. Now you come to my hotel. How long are you staying? Uh, I get to see my boyfriend. I, I could stay forever if you want. You're going to sleep overnight? Yes, baby. You're going to sleep overnight? Yes, baby. Uh, now you're talking now. Let's go. Vincent, what are you doing here this early? Um, I don't go. I couldn't sleep last night. Why? I don't go, please. Accept me. Marry me, and I promise I will never hurt you in this life. Please get up, friends. Just stand there. Ah, you don't have to kneel for me. I'm, I'm not God. But if I may ask, you remember the first time we met, right? Sure. You told me you wanted us to be, like you told me I should be your girlfriend. Yes. And I now also remember, immediately I told you I was keeping my virginity for my husband like until my wedding night. <laughs> you changed and said I should get married to you. So I'm a bit confused. Do you really know what you want or you're just saying that just to have my body? Oh, come on, stop that. Have your body for what? You know, meeting for the very first time, the wrong thing I would say at that point is talking about marriage. So, I, I think we needed to start as friends. Then from friendship, we will not build something good, something serious that will lead us to marriage. That is why I said you should be my friend. And then after knowing you very well, I will now talk about marriage. So, do you think you have known me enough to talk about marriage now? Um, <clears throat> Not well enough though, but the little I've known about you, I am satisfied within me that you'll be a good wife. It's just you, you'll be a good wife. I, I, I am okay with you. I just want you to accept me as your man. Okay, um, I'll have to discuss with my brother. It's your brother? Okay, so where is he? He's in school. And one more thing, I would like my brother to finish school before I even talk about marriage. Oh, you don't have a problem with that. Oh, the basic thing is first, accept me as your man. Every other thing is just um, secondary. And trust me, when we get to that bridge, we will know how to cross it. Okay, let me discuss with him first. Thank you. I am, I am happy now. <laughs> Yeah, I It's okay. Yeah. So, is that the only thing that brought you to my house this early morning? You, you deserve it now. Uh, because I was worried all through the night, I couldn't sleep. I said, let me rush down to your place this early morning to see you. Alright. Yeah. No problem. Once I discuss with him, I'll, I'll get back to you. It's okay. Mm -hmm. Alright. Uh, Chige, this is the, the drink our visitor came with. Keep it. Bros. Um, my son. Nine. Once again, you're welcome. Thank you, Nine. No. Salary. Um, you said uh, your name is Benson. Yes. Sir. From uh, Ifedora's family. Yes. Sir. Uh, 
in the Umala, Suke village from this kingdom. Exactly. You're welcome. Thank you. Now, huh? uh, in Igbo land, one person, one person does not marry a wife. Yes. Hmm? Mm. So, uh, I know your father, Ifedora, is late. Chief Ifedora, I know he's late. But I know one of his brothers, I mean, one of your uncles, is, uh, what is that his name? Is, uh, oh. uh -huh. So, why is he not here with you? Uh, Nai, I know all that. He wanted to come with me, but I asked him not to come for now. I wanted to come and make my intention known to the family. As soon as um, the family says yes, especially Adugo, then I'll come with them and do the needful. Uh, uh, what are we waiting for now? Everything done soft now. We've accepted you now. I know you again. Uh, uh, everything is okay. Yeah. okay. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. What's your problem? What is it? Are you Adugo? You say you are already Are you Adugo? Is he here to marry your or to, to marry Adugo? Go and call Adugo. Ada, show, 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 show. Ada. Sure, sure, what sure, is sure, wrong sure. with you children of nowadays? Uh, I never no, We are trying. Mm. Thank God. It's okay. Thank God. No, oh? uh, yeah. welcome. Thank you so much. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Um, Adug. Uh -huh. Greet our visitors. Greet now, nah, greet your guy. Ah, hey, hey. You're welcome. Yeah. Thank you. Um, Adugo, yeah. this young man here by name Benson, he said uh, that he has been discussing something with you for a long time now. He said that he's here to make his intention known to we, your people. Yeah. If we, we will accept him, if, uh, in fact, you accept him so that. He will come with his people to perform the marriage rite. Hmm. So, uh, what do we tell him? Yeah, now nah, you don't start now. Nah. Talk now. Nah. My friend, I, I, I take it easy. What is your problem, Chike? Allow her to go to the side. Uh, Uncle, leave this guy. This guy don't like doing one shy, shy something. Now, nah. this people know that. Sorry, they know themselves, Uncle, but no shaking. Yeah, now nah, you say. Right. Nah, you can slow. Uncle, tell him to come with his people. Oh, Zubo, Zubo. <laughs> Huh? Brotherly! Uh, <laughs> Brotherly! Uh, Come on! Uh, my uh, uh, my uh, in law uh, uh, My son, you had a do good. She said you should come with your people. So, we are waiting. Huh? We are waiting. It's okay, thank you, sir. You're welcome. Thank you. We are waiting. We are waiting. We are waiting. We are waiting, Gary. Come on. Yeah. Oh. Once again, you're welcome to my house. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah. Your house is really beautiful. Oh. Wow. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, it's okay. All right. <laughs> so, how about your mother and your siblings? Oh. Oh, Jess. My younger sister gave birth, and so my mother travels to the city for more work. Oh. And my brother is based in America. Oh, mm. that's nice. Yeah. <laughs> so you're the only one at home now? Yes, for now. Uh, okay. I am the only one at home. But my mother will be coming back home, hopefully next uh, month. And um, <coughs> she'll be happy to meet you as her son's wife. <laughs> no. Not wife, because you haven't done anything yet. But I've done the introduction. Come on, introduction is not enough. Uh, mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, you see, <clears throat> I might not uh, really be enough, but I'm trying to. Yeah. <laughs> so, what are you doing? Uh, relax. I'm just trying to, you know, hold you. I, you know. You know, feel you and um, have you, you know. Is that why you invited me here? You cannot touch me. 
It's too early now. You cannot touch me. I am your husband. You are my wife. I, I just want to touch you so we have a, a place we can start from. Do you know? And uh, she will be my woman. But don't worry. It made my mother comes back next month. We will come with our kinsmen to meet with your people so I can do the normal thing and uh, bring you back home. Stop. Then wait till then. When your mother comes back, you bring your people and come and meet my people. Then you, you bring me back home and you can have me to yourself. Let's say while we are waiting, we have to get to know no, ourselves. Please better. stop. What are you doing? You said your mother will come back soon, right? Uh -huh, so just wait. Just give it a little time and when she comes back, you do the right thing and you can have me to yourself. Please. What? Please, I, I, I want to leave. Maybe you should just come and see me. Uh, you should really have enough here, you know? Please, I want to leave. I want to leave. I'll see you. That's the car. Now the car be that. Now the car. Now the car. Now him. Baby. See your babe now. Huh? Guy. Adugo. Yes. Chike, he's my brother. Uh -uh. Police station. What what happened? What what did he do? What? Ch Chike killed somebody. How? How, how did it happen? Somebody called me that my, my sister's phone number, that she, she was rushed here. Oh, uh, are you the guest brother? Yes, yes, please. Where is, how is she? Where is she now? Oh, um, actually sir, she was rushed here unconscious. I wouldn't know if she's dead by now. But the doctor is still in the... Dead? Yeah, um, hold on sir. But the doctor is still in the ICU with her. Please, how can I see the doctor? I want to see her. Uh, sir, please, you have to calm down. You have to calm down. Don't, don't, don't tell me to calm down. I'm talking about my sister here. You're asking me to calm down. Oh, don't. Good evening. My name is Jonathan. He rushed my sister here. My sister is Joy. Oh, okay. Yes. You're the brother. Yes, dog. Please, how is she? Well, Mr. Jonathan. Yes, doctor. There is a big problem. Oh, God. Your sister, she's still in coma at the ICT. Coma? Yes, and I'm afraid that she might not make it. But, but we'll do our possible best to see how we can revive her. Because the beating that she received was just too much. Uh, she, she sustained a lot of internal injuries as a result. Internal injuries? Doctor, who is the, where is the beast that did this to her? Um, and the person that brought her here, please, where can I find the person? As for the person that brought her here, since he left, he has not returned. But the guy that did this, he has been apprehended by the police. Oh, that's good. That's good, Doc. Doctor, please. Anything you can do, anything you can do to bring her back to life, please, anything. I can pay anything, any amount of money. Doctor, please. I would try my possible best, but it is imperative that we pray for her because she will need the help of God at this time. So, uh, don't worry, just the nurse will attend to you. I have something else to do when you're ready. I will talk. Anything, Doctor. Let me just 
just singing. He's, he's my brother. Please let me just, just talk to him. Please, sir. Just talk to him. Madam, I said no. Do you realize the magnitude of what he has done? The offense he has committed, do you? And I said no. Now listen. Just pray that nothing should happen to that girl. Just pray that nothing should happen to that girl. Because if she dies, your brother will be taken to court and be charged for murder. Hey! But if she survives, your brother will also be taken to court and be charged for attempting murder. Hey! Just know that. She can't kill me all! She can't kill me all! Please, 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 hey, madam. Please, sir. Hey, please, sir. I don't please. want this. Don't want this you. is an office. Please, I hate noise. Please, or better still, please, sir. you may leave. Please, sir. Please, sir. Please, sir. Just, 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 just give us. Just Why disturbing the peace of this place? We're very sorry, sir. Sorry, sorry, please. I'm sorry, sir. Please. Sorry, sorry, please. Please, I want to see. Just to see him, please. Please, sir. I just say you cannot see him. Or if you want to see him, come yesterday and see him. Sir, how can you say we should come back yesterday? Sir, please. Just pity us. Sorry, sir, please. Do you know the hospital where the girl was taken to? Don't worry. I know the hospital. Mm -hmm. I can direct you to the hospital. Just come. Madugo, I'm a Chike's, Chike's elder sister. How, how is the girl? What's her situation? What, what's, what's happening? Is she okay? What is happening to her? Sorry, who is Chike? Chike now, Chike, the one that beat up the girl, Joy. Joy that was rushed into your oh, hospital. Oh, oh. You mean that beast? He's a beast, and even more than a beast. But sir, uh, how is the situation of the girl? How, how is she? Well, I must say she's in a very critical condition. And as we speak, she's in coma in the intensive care unit. What's he? Coma? Chike, hey. Chike, you will not kill me. What kind of thing is this? So what's this condition? What's, what's happening? Uh, what, doctor, wait. Is there any chance of her survival? At this point, we have to rely on the intervention of God. We have to pray for her because she's in a very, very terrible... Ah, it's so terrible. I can't explain it here, sir. Doctor. Doctor, please. I'm begging you. Just do anything you can to save the girl's life. Because if she dies, I'll, I'll just die too. And that's because Chike is the only thing I have. Our parents are dead. Doctor, please. Because of God, just, just help us. Don't worry. Calm down. Like I said, I will do my best. Doctor, please try. But you have to pray for her. No, I'll, I'll continue praying for her, please. But doctor, just try. Please, sir. Please. But doctor, can I see any of her relatives? Um, you can meet up with one of the nurses at the reception. They will show it to her brother. Excuse me. Yeah. Okay. So, how do I go about it? Nurse, uh, please, the doctor said you should show me the girl's brother. Uh, yeah, I mean, the girl that is in coma in the theater. Oh, that's the man over there. Thank 
Good day, sir. Hold on, hold on. Let me call you. Man. Yes. What can I do for you? Please, sir. I would like to talk to you. Talk. I'm listening. No, sir. Please, I would like us to talk outside. Why outside? Let's talk here. Please, sir. It's very important. Let's just talk outside, please. Are you mad or something? How can you bring me out here telling me about settlement? When my sister is there in coma, struggling with her life, and all you will do is here tell me about settlement. Just, just have mercy upon me, please. I am just a woman, so I cannot think like you, a man. Please, just have mercy. All I'm asking for is for, for us to find a solution, please. Do you know that my sister is lying lifeless in coma in there? She's not eating, she's not had anything to drink either. I know. If I say I don't feel your pain, I'll be lying. Please, just, just have mercy upon me. See, let me tell you, he is my only brother. Our parents are dead. And I'm just the only one suffering and sponsoring him in school, which he messed up. Please, sir, please. I'm just begging. That's all I'm asking. Please, just have mercy. Please. Please, sir, please. Now you listen to me. If we must talk about settlements, we have to talk about my sister's life first. I need to be assured that she's she back out of coma. Then we can talk settlements. Please, sir. Please, I'm begging. Let me tell you. If we have to settle this, the police must be involved. No, sir. Excuse please. me. Please, sir, we cannot involve the police. Please. My dear, it's a long story. When I asked his friends, they said he, he saw his girlfriend with another man. And before you know it, he started beating the girl. And she fainted and ended up in coma. Wait, wait. Why would he do such a thing because of um, a girl? I don't even know. I, I don't know. So, what is the situation of things now? The situation is not looking good. Though. It's not looking good at all. I met with the doctor. The doctor said I should pray that it will only take God's intervention for the girl to come back alive. I, I asked to see some of her siblings. I, I ended up talking with her brother. That one said, he's not even going to do anything or settle anything with me until the sister comes out alive. So that is where we are right now. I don't even know what to do again. This is serious trouble. It is. Oh, but don't worry. Don't worry. Everything will be fine. Okay? Everything will be fine. So, when are you going back? I'm going back there tomorrow. I, I only came here to, you know, run around to raise some money just in case there is need for it. Oh, I'll go back there tomorrow. Tomorrow? Yes. Oh. Really? Hey! God, I thank you. Father Lord, I glorify your name. Ha! Ah, God, indeed what you cannot do does not exist. Father, I thank you. Thank you. It's alright, madam, though she's here at the hospital because she has not fully recovered. Uh, he passed a very important information now. What information? What? According to him, the doctor says the bill so far is 370,000. So he better than pay off the bill. 370 what? M me? I should. So, officer, how? How am I going to raise 370,000? Listen, madam. Mr. Jonathan is a very simple man. He's a peaceful man. He doesn't want any problem. All he wants is everything to be settled. So, I advise you go and clear the bill. Clear the bill? 370,000? Officer, from where? I, I, I don't even have that kind of money. I, I don't have it. So, how am I going to clear the bill? Madam, madam, madam wait. It seems you don't understand the magnitude of what your brother has done. You don't. Listen, listen, listen. You have just two days to do that. 
If not, your brother will be taken to court and will be charged for attempted murder. Would you mind this to prison? No, officer. Of course, I don't want my brother to go to prison. But at two days, what am I going to do? Where am I going to raise that kind of money from? The period is too short now, officer. What, what am I supposed to do? What, what am I going to do? Well, it's very simple. I would advise you go to the hospital, discuss with the doctor and Mr. Jonathan. But remember, in the next two days, if you're unable to settle with them, your brother will be taken to court. From there to prison. Very simple. But if you are able to settle with them, there will be peace. And your brother will be released. Mr. Jonathan is a very simple man. He doesn't want any problem. So do the right thing, okay? No, 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 officer. Let me just go to the hospital right away. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. God, please. Please help me. Where do you expect me to get that kind of money from? I am not doing any serious business to raise that kind of money. Please. Our parents are dead. And I know that my brother just wants to be wicked to me. But all I'm asking, please. He's my only brother. I cannot, I cannot just allow him to go to prison. Please, sir, please. I'm begging. Just have mercy, please. See, all this you're pleading is not my business. I am not the doctor that gives his bill. Go and plead with the doctor. Whatever bill he gives, how we pay it is not my business. All that matters to me is that my sister leaves this hospital. And if your brother fails to do so, I will send him to court and I will jail him. Just have mercy, please. I'm, I'm begging, please. Please. I don't think I have time for all this. I don't want to believe what they told me is true. I don't want to believe what they told me is true. Oh, wonderful. When he fell in love, she can wonderful. When no one wants more. Oh, wonderful. No one to help me. You see, that's my brother. He's a student. I am the only one sponsoring him with the little money I make from my provision shop. Please. I'm begging. Help me, please. I'm the only one catering for everything, and I, I don't even know where else to get the money from. Please. I don't want my brother to go to jail. It's okay, it's okay, get up, get up. It's okay. It's okay. Huh? I've heard you. I've heard everything you said. And I totally understand your situation. I do. But I need you to understand something. This is a hospital. And it's somebody's business. If I don't manage it well, it will, go, it will collapse. I don't want that on my conscience. Please, I, I, I believe you can still do something. Please. I will consider you. And it's just because of you. Because you know this business, like, we don't handle it well. To seem as though we're not trained well in school. I know. Please. Please, sir, please. I'm doing this for you. Sorry, I'm not I, your brother. I really appreciate it, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Uh, we are supposed to pay three hundred and sixty thousand naira, right? Okay, I will give you a discount of hundred thousand naira, so you can just go and fetch two hundred and sixty thousand naira, and that's the best I can do. That's the best I can do. Huh? Okay, but well, thank you, sir. Oh, please stop crying. I'm not hmm? crying. Again. Stop crying. It will be well. Yes, thank you. Well. thank you. Thank huh? you, sir. Thank you. So just when you're ready, just let me know. Yes, sir. Thank Take care. You. I don't want to believe that the rumor is true. Oh, wonderful.
Save me from this situation. God, please help me. The only cash I have on me now is 80,000 Naira only. What, what will he do for me? What? I've seen the shops. Okay. How much? Um, I know the country is hard now and um, things are really difficult. Mm. I would have said 500, but just give me 350,000. Eh? Yes. For this small shop? No. Oh, God. No, it's too much. Now. No, now. How can you call this shop small? It's not small, look. See, by the time you add up all these things, ha, it's even more than that 350. But because I need money, I just said you should give me. See, madam, I'll do the shop and I like the shop. It's good. Very nice. Very nice. I'll give you 100,000. Ha, Oga, please. I don't now. want to waste my time. No, please, yeah? sir. No, you can go inside, Oga. I see you everything. Can go inside I see everything inside now. The freezer. See now. This. I, I go inside, sir. Just That's go why inside. I'm this shop. 100,000. Ah, this freezer alone, how much is it? Sir, please now. Please. Madam, please. I'll, I'll try you. Try for, uh, for 100,000, bitch. Do it in my eyes. You see the thing. The two things that they have. I'll make it 120,000. Hey, Oga, okay, it's still small. No. Anything more than that, I won't find it. Hey, Oga, okay, please now. Please just add something. Add something it's to okay it. Like that. Anything more than that, I can't be able to do it. Okay. Okay. Give me. You can bring the money. Okay. Adam, make, let me go and get the money. Ah, uh -uh. Oga, you don't have the cash here. How can I carry the cash up and down? Eh? Uh, so five minutes, I'm okay. Five, under five minutes, I'll bring the money. Eh. Yes. Please, I'm, I'm waiting. No problem. Oga, I'm, I'm waiting. So, doctor billed them 260,000 Naira. And you're the one who is going to pay the money. Yes. And this, I have to, I just, I have to pay within the next two days. Which is tomorrow. That's, if I don't pay it, they will take my brother to court and charge him for attempted murder. Which they will eventually take him to prison. I don't want my brother to go to prison. I had to sell my shop with all the goods in it. And I was able to raise 120,000 to add to the cash that I already have of 80,000. But I still need. 60,000 to complete the money. That is why I decided to go 
come and ask you to please help me. Please. I don't want my brother to go to prison. Please. So, in a nutshell, what are you asking me to give to you 60,000 naira? Yes, sir. Yes. God. If I may ask, what is the criteria for asking of this help? Are you asking me to give you this 60,000 naira as my girlfriend or as my wife? Person, I, I, I don't understand. Why are you asking this? But we're already husband husband and wife to be. Husband and wife to be. Mm -hmm. Fine. Let me ask you a simple question. As husband and wife to be, let me just put it straight. Have you ever allowed me as a husband to be to make love to you? Have you ever allowed me as your husband to be, to touch you? The answer to these questions are no, you've not. Benson. Benson. I am really surprised you're saying this. Like... I don't even know what you're talking about. Surprised? I just wanted to know. Because you don't need to be surprised. I asked a harmless question. Okay. Just go straight to the point. What do you want? Beautiful question. And I will give you a beautiful answer. Allow me to make love to you and I'll give you the money you're asking for. Benson. Benson. You call me your wife to be right. Yes, just look at the kind of conditions you're giving me. Is that fair? You know what? Keep your money. I don't need it. I suffer day and night. Just to see you make it in this world I sacrifice everything Just for you to make it I could give me a miracle When I'm watching see me jogging I see one day more It is the world before I could give me What are you doing in my house by this time of the night? have the money in this house now. Why do you ask? Just answer me. Do you have the money in the house now? Yes. I have the money in this house. Take me to your room. <laughs> Let's go.
Here, I'll take it. It's 60,000 Naira, so take it and solve your problem. Come on, have it. <sighs> of me because I have a problem you took my virginity to render my life useless. What am I even saying? You have already rendered me useless. you can graduate and become something for both of us, for you and I. But what did you do? You had the mind. Chiki, <sighs> you had the mind to spend the little money I was sending to you. On girls, especially Joy. When I heard all the things you were doing, Chike, I confronted you. But hey, you looked me in the face and lied. You lied to me, keeping an innocent face. Hey, Chike. You are heartless. You are wicked. No. I have lost everything. My my shop. My my goods. Even even the little savings I had. I've, I've lost everything. <laughs> So 
What did I say? What, 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 what do you mean? <laughs> huh? Wait. You, you, you've lost everything. Like, you've lost your... your like you've lost your shop. You, you've sold everything. Your, your, your shop and everything inside. Huh? Is that what you're saying? <laughs> Sister? Is that what you're saying? <laughs> I called you out here so we can talk. As you can see, things are no longer normal for both of us. I have lost my provision business and you have dropped out of school. I, I, I would suggest we go and look for something to do to, to support each other. Because it doesn't even make sense for us to just sit down here and wait for manna to fall from heaven. Which we both know is not possible. So let's just look for something. If not, hunger will kill us all. Mm, sister. The thing that pains me is that... This is not your fault. I'm the one to blame. If I had listened to you and my friends, maybe things wouldn't have turned out this way. But I didn't listen and look at now. I've, I've, I've lost everything now. I, I, I feel like I've lost everything. I, I'm a university dropout. I'm a school dropout. I'm so ashamed of myself. I'm, I'm ashamed. Cheeky. We all make mistakes. Our ability to learn from our mistakes is what really makes us who we are. There is no point sitting down here and blaming yourself. Because that is not going to bring back all those things we have lost. But for you to just brace up and face life again. I've heard you sister. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, my daughter, how are you and my grandchild? Oh, better. Thank God. Thank God. Remember everything I told you before I left. Please, remember to always breastfeed my baby. 
very, very important. Yeah, breastfeeding is very important, more important than the milk we are talking about. Yeah, keep breastfeeding him. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Oh, your brother. He's here. Oh. I have not had any serious discussion with him since yesterday I came back. Yeah, do you want to talk to him? It's okay. Your sister. Adana. <laughs> the youngest mommy in town. <laughs> yes, how you doing? Yes, yes, she told me. <laughs> okay, okay. All right, sure. So, how's your husband and how's the newborn baby doing? Mm. It's okay, it's okay. I know, brother. Huh? Okay, okay. All right, sure. Okay, hold on for her. Okay. <laughs> Hello, my baby. How is my in-law? Has he gone to work? It's okay. My regards to him. It's all right. Bye. <laughs> hey, your sister is so funny. Hey. <laughs> the youngest mommy in town. I'm telling you. <laughs> hey, Benson. Hey, hey, hey. You were about to talk to me before your sister's call came in. Oh, yes. Um, a quick one. You know, we not really had time to talk since yesterday you came back. Exactly. Um, you know you've been on my neck. For you rising me, asking me to get a decent girl to get married to. Have you seen someone? Oh, take it easy, mom. Come oh, on. Mama, wait, wait. I, I'm taking it easy. Just talk to me. Have you seen anyone? All right. Yes, I have found one. Wow. Yes, and um, I have gone to see her people and they accepted me. Wow. That's my son. <laughs> That's basically my son. Now you have shown me that you are the true son of your late father. Uh, you <laughs> Thank you, mama. This is good news. Yes, this is you. good news. I love this. I love this. Thank Wonderful. You. You're welcome. Thank you. This is good. <laughs> uh, so, who is this girl in question and um, mm. where is she from? From which town, you know, everything about her. Ah, mom, she's, um, first and foremost, her name is Adugo. Okay. She's the daughter of um, late Longinus Okafo from Obinze village. Mom, she need to see this girl. Mom, she's tall, shapey, beautiful, and above all, very nice lady. Mom, you will like wait, her. Wait, wait. Longinus Okafo. Mm hmm from Obinze village. Yes. Is it not the daughter of Let Agnes? Mom, you know the family? Beautiful. That makes it so easy for me. Please, 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 Benson. That will not be possible. You can never marry from that family. Not when I am still alive. Mba. Mom, mom, no, 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 please, mom. If you say that I'm not going to marry from that family, then you should tell me why I shouldn't marry from this family. So, what is the problem? Benson, look for another girl to marry. As for that family, we can never have anything to do with them. Mom, please. Please. You can't just cut me short like that. You can't tell me that I can't marry from the family. Mom, do you know what I went through to get that girl? Do you know the stress she made me pass through? I passed through the eye of a needle to get that girl. Mom, you can't just come out and tell me that I'm not going to marry her. Tell me, what is the problem? Benson, can you change this topic? Please. Oh, Mom, I am sorry I can't change the topic. Tell me, what is the problem? You cannot change the topic. No problem. You can sit here and talk to yourself as much as you can. I'm inside. Am I, am I walking out on me? Mama! Oh, I'm fine. I'm good. Mom? I want to discuss something with you. Please, 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 Benson. If it is because of that girl, 
You better save yourself the stress. I, I, I don't want to listen. I'm not interested. Please. Let me enjoy this movie. Mom. Mom, why? Why don't you want me to marry a girl after my own heart? What has she done to you? You want to know what she did to me? Of course, I want to know. One, she's from a poor family. Two, she's not a graduate. And her mother was my arch enemy when she was alive. For that, nothing good will come from my family to that family. Never. And finally, that girl is not of the same class with you. As you can see, there will be no marriage. Light and darkness have nothing in common. Absolutely nothing. Uh, this sounds so ridiculous. Mom, can I, can I ask you a question? You said you had a problem with Adugo's mom. What has this got to do with my marriage to Adugo? Secondly, what is that thing that happened that made both of you become arc enemies? That is none of your business. And let me sound this as a note of warning to you. If I ever see that girl in this house, I will pour acid on her and kill myself. I think this discussion is over. Allow me to enjoy this movie. I will pour acid on her. Kill myself. This is the end of this discussion. Mom, is that what? All right. That's okay. All right. And she's from a poor family background. Not up to my class. Not up to my standard. Oh, my mother. My mother is right after all. Oh, <laughs> Benson. Benson, wake up. Wake up, Benson. You've been blind all this while. How can I? How can I? My class, my standard, mingle with a girl of that caliber, of that standard, who can measure up where I am. That little brat. Oh no. And my mother. My mother threatened me that if I dare get married to Adugo, she will pour acid on Adugo and kill herself. Oh, time's already not ready to lose my mother because of that little girl. That little brat called Adugo. I can't. I can't afford to lose my mother. Benson. Benson, you have to act wise. Benson, you have to apply wisdom. Yes, I know what to do. I do go. I. <clears throat> 
I want you to understand me. I, 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 I've spoken with my mother about you. Mm -hmm. But she wouldn't understand. She threatened to kill herself if, if I disobey her and get married to you. Listen, honestly, I don't even understand what you're saying. I know you're talking, but you've been going round and round in circles, so I don't know what you're saying. And again, you did not even tell me your mother is back from Omugo. Uh, uh, yes, um, she came back a few days ago. And um, immediately she came back, we, we talked about you. Okay. And um, everything we discussed centered on you. And... Um, as much as I try to make her understand how far I have gone with you, mm -hmm. uh, she wouldn't. Along the line, she just got angry. Uh, she threatened that if I, if I disobeyed her and get married to you, that she, she will pour you acid and kill herself. I don't want anything to happen to you. And at the same time, I wouldn't want to lose her. After taking my virginity, this is all you have to tell me. Benson. It's okay. I am not going to tell you to disobey your mother. What? Let God be the judge. Just listen. Just go, please. Please, I... I want you to forgive me. It's, it's, it's not my fault. What? What did you say? Forgive me. <laughs> it is not your fault? And I, I should forgive you? Just go, go! Please, I am I'm begging Benson, you. Benson, ju just go! Because just listen, listen to me and uh, understand where, where I'm coming from, please. Uh. Benson, just leave! Leave! Benson, leave! Just go, go! Go! I saw that your um, that your friend, uh, Amarachi, and she told me that you should. Sister, sister, ah, why are you crying now? Eh? So what's going on? Why, why, why are you crying? What's happening? Benson called off the marriage. Huh? No, I don't understand. I don't understand. He, he called off the marriage. On to it now. For what? No, why? 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 What, what happened now? What, what happened? Ah, tell me. Why Why? Why? why you call off the marriage now? For what? See, uh, sister. See, uh, uh, see. The thing is that uh, look at it from the other side. You understand me? Maybe God even wants you, you to know that he's not the right man for you. Eh, uh, now. God wants him to know you. Uh, God wants you to know he's not the right man for you. God wants you to be away from him. All his nonsense. Eh? So you should, you should even thank God. Ah, he's not the right man for you now. So ah, what? Why? Why would you be crying for him? For what? <laughs> for Benson? Kwa? For for what now? Chike. Eh? I am not crying because he called off the marriage. So why are you crying now? Why are you crying? 
Sister, forget this guy. Forget. But, but why, why best? Why best go disgrace my sister like this now? Why would you call off the wedding? For what now? What do you now? Why? Why? Huh. Benson. Be Benson. Ah. Oh. Oh. Chicken. You're here. Um, I am sorry I, I didn't come to see you when you came back from detention. Well, that's not why I'm here. No, that's, that's, that's not why I'm here, bros. That's not why I'm here at all, at all, at all. My question to you now is why? Why? Eh? Why now? Why, why, why would you disgrace my sister in such manner? For what reason now? I'm not waiting now. Why? No, no, no. Tell me if you were not ready to marry her, why would you propose in the first place now? For what? Why? Chike, 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 don't talk this way. Why would I talk this way now? Why don't I talk this way? Why are you wasting your time with this idiot? What are you explaining to him? That you proposed to his sister and let her change to your mind. Is anything wrong with that? And you, get out of my house before I call the police. Is marriage by force? I'm asking you, is marriage by force? You want to know why he did that? I will give you the answer. Your family is poor. Very poor. And your sister is below my son's level. Are you satisfied? Oh, wait, 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 oh, 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 you, you, you're you listening to your mother. No, 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 I should, I should leave because my sister is poor. My, my sister is poor. If you don't leave this compound now, you will not like what I will do. Get out! Ah, uh, bro, so you hear him my talk now. May you waka waka beg. No, Benson, I need to talk this one, so. May, 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 may waka. Make, make, make her go. But Malay, just talk now. Malay, just finish to, yeah. No, Malay, just waka. talk. Malay, may, 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 just go like... No, 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 no
I talk to you like that? Who are you? Why can't I talk to you like that? Madam, no listen. I can talk to you anyhow I like since you have refused to respect yourself. Oh, yes. Madam, your family is rich. No doubt. But all I'm asking is for you to leave my poor family alone. Oh, yes. Hmm. Madam, don't push me. Don't push me. Don't push me. Don't make me remember what your son did to me. If not, I'll report all of you to the oracle. Your son deceived me. All in the name of marriage. And took away my virginity. And now he's telling his stories. And you stand here. Madam, just get out. Get out! Are you the only girl that has lost her virginity before? I'm asking you. It is because you are desperate to come and enjoy my son's wealth. That is why you lost control as a woman. And he took advantage of you. Oh yes. Are you not ashamed? Now I'm asking you. You poor indebted thing. Are you not ashamed? And for your information. I have gotten my son a wife. So stay clear, madam. That I respect elderly people doesn't mean I fear them. Now get out. Get out before I push you out. Push who? You push me. Try it. No, try it and see if you will not end in prison. Me, I, me. Yes, you. I, I do go. Yes, you dirty ten. And in prison. Yeah. You heard me right. Just wait. Just wait. No. I take my dreams of becoming a graduate much more serious. But just look at me now. Look at the job I'm doing. A boy with a bright future. Because of my foolishness, I've thrown it all away. God, God, please just help me. Help me to be careful and more focused in these times. We men. Girls. <sighs> we men. Girls. Get thee behind me. Just get thee behind me. Check me. Adugo. Adugo! Ah, Nae! What are you doing in the Majo Keke's land? Majo, who asked you to clear it? He asked me to, to clear it. For what one? He's paying me for it, Uncle. I, I even said when I finish this one, he's going to show me another one to clear. He's paying for it? Yes. Don't tell me you are the one that killed all this, all, all this land. Yes, now, Uncle, see, he's only remaining this place, so I'll soon finish and he will pay me. Ah! Uh -uh. Yes. If you needed anything, why didn't you come and tell me? Uh, eh? I wouldn't have given you the money. Uncle, you know me, I don't like to disturb you now. I don't like to disturb you. There is dignity in labor, so I just want to work hard. I do go. Mm. Go home. Uncle, okay. eh? I said go home. Uh, Uncle, I can't go home. I need to finish this so that he will pay me. If I don't finish it, he will not pay me. Let me ask you, what do you need the money for? Uh, uh, Uncle, huh. You know now, ever since I lost my shop, I just have to do menial jobs to, to keep body and soul together. So because you lost your shop and the goods inside, for that you should be going around doing all these menial jobs? Sorry, those things happened when I was away, but now that I am back, if you need anything, you come and tell me and I will do it for you. Huh? What is it? I don't like to disturb you, please. Let me just... How much is the money? How much is it going to pay after doing the job? 5,000. And you're still going to show me another one, another farmland that I'm going to clear. Is that what you mean? He's going to show another land, another land to kill it. Five thousand, okay? Yes. 
Fire take. This is 10,000 naira. Ah, Uncle. If you need anything, come and tell me. I will give it to you. And stop disgracing me in this village. Uncle, thank you so much, sir. Thank you, sir. But let me just finish this on. If I... I said, Ona, find you with this thing now. Okay, Ona. Thank you. But Uncle, let me finish now. I've already If I hit you with this thing now. Sorry. I know, I know I've been a disappointment to you um, because of everything I've done, you know, in the past. Uh, you're not happy. I'm also not happy. But you see, I'm also very sorry, you know, for everything. I mean, just look at you. I mean, you're not a liberal. You lost everything because of me, and it really pains me. I, I, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm really sorry. Chicken, the truth is, I have long forgiven you. Hmm? So it's it's okay. Everything is fine. Everything is fine. Okay. Um. Um. Another thing is, I. I I feel like I'm wasting here, you know. I'm wasting away in this village. I I need to, you know, go somewhere where I'll be very useful, you know, to you and, and to myself. And that place is the city. So with that, I just want to ask you for this one favor. If you can, you know, just help me go to the city. Um, um, uh, I, 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 would, I would like to just borrow money from somebody, you know and let the person give you, then you give me, then I'll go to the city. Uh, then when I hustle and make, you know, something, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll give you back that money. It's not like it's for free. I just need you to just borrow and give me the money, then I'll just go to the city. To be beneficial, you know. You know let, let, let me be... Let, let me help myself and help you too. Really? Yes. What what do you really think? What what do you take me for? I don't understand. No, I don't understand you two. I, I, I should go and borrow, borrow borrow money from where? Please, please, Chike. In fact, just go, just go. Sister, I'm just Chike, just just, just go. Sister, just borrow this more money. Sacrifice 
Contractor, where are you? You want to buy materials? Okay, I will be going. But there is something I saw here I don't like. Okay, when I come tomorrow, I will show you. Were you not the same girl I saw two days ago sitting down there? Yes, sir, it's me, sir. Because I was tired. Why would a beautiful girl like you be doing the kind of job that is meant for men? It doesn't fit you. Okay. This is the only job I found myself in. You know. Besides, my parents are dead and it's just me and my brother, so I just have to do anything to, you know, hustle so that we we'll have something to feed. Your parents are dead? Yes, sir. Your brother, what is he doing for a living? He's not doing anything, sir. I won't... Okay. I'll be here tomorrow. When I come tomorrow, we'll see, we'll talk, okay? Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. Okay. Condition, he make a Where's Oh, mom. Hello. <coughs> How are you? Very well, sir. Well, you said you wanted to discuss something with me. Yes, dear. And without wasting much of your time, I have to go straight to the point. Okay. This is Sandra, the girl I want you to marry. Hi. <laughs> I have talked with her and she has accepted. Yeah, Sandra. Yes, Mama. <laughs> this is Benson, my son. Oh, wow. Your husband to be. <laughs> oh. Wow, um, well done, sir. <laughs> uh, you heard what my mom said. Yeah. Mm, and she said she has discussed everything with you. Yes. As a matter of fact, your mother has told me so much about you. Lots of good things. <laughs> and I am so glad that I finally met you. <laughs> In fact, you're even better than, than I thought. You look, <laughs> you look good. You're so handsome. <laughs> <laughs> really? Uh, uh, it's okay. So, does that mean you've accepted to marry me? Uh, of course, yes. Yes, I... Even before I met you, <laughs> I already agreed. Uh, I, I think I like you. <laughs> I like you too. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Mom, if getting married to help put a smile on your face and make you happy, definitely. I will do that for you. Wow. I'm already smiling. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Sandra, right? Yes, Sandra. Uh, ben Singh. Lazi. <laughs> <laughs> uh, All right. Well, I think what you've heard uh, that is from my mom. Hmm? Mm. I would suggest to go upstairs and uh, have one-on-one -on -one chat. <laughs> That's fine. Are you one-on-one? Okay one? Yeah, sure. Mama? <laughs> uh, <laughs> let me talk it upstairs. This is beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> Beautiful! <laughs> Please, you people should go up. <laughs> Enjoy yourself! Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I see. This is good. This is good. So, um... Chike. Yes, sister. What I'm saying is that um, a visitor will be coming to see us tomorrow. Mm. Yes. Yeah. Man or woman? A man. Man? Mm. Man. What? <laughs> man. 
What's wrong with you? I don't want to. I don't want. I don't want. Please, I don't want. It's, uh, it's too early. It's too early. Please, I don't I, want. I, I, I don't want to. I don't want to any, any man. You now tell me that one man has fallen in love with you. The man has proposed to you. And the next thing, the man will serve you breakfast. You now start crying. Anyhow, I, I don't want to. I don't want to. You now try to be crying overnight. I won't be able to sleep. Please, please, leave man for now. Leave man for now. Can you stop? You've had enough man problems. Leave man for now, now. I know what I'm saying now. I know what I'm saying. I know you. I, I don't want the problem now. It's too early now. You just came out from heartbreak. What's all this now? Chike, Chike, let me ask you one thing. Why do you think that my, my whole life is centered around men? Why? Anything you have to do with man ends up with marriage and the heartbreak. And I don't want. I don't want now. Ah, haven't you eaten enough breakfast? Can, it's okay can, now. Can you shut up now and listen? Yeah. I'm saying my own. No. I'm saying my own. I don't want anybody crying, cry, crying, disturbing me. Chike. I like my sleep. Chike. If you may know, this one is not about marriage. Eh. Yes. Eh. As I was saying before, I was rudely interrupted. Okay. Eh, this man is the owner of the building site where I work. Okay. So I don't know, for some reason, he saw me while I was working. So okay. he called me and started asking me some questions about our family. Okay. Yeah, I had to open up to him more. All right. I told him everything. Okay. Like I told him how things have been so difficult and I've been the only one struggling, mm. you know, trying to okay. make ends meet mm. and all of that. Okay. Why are you all this what is all this okay? No. <laughs> okay. I know now. We are, we are getting there. Please just listen. Uh, no, no, okay, continue. <laughs> I know where this thing is going to. Continue, continue. So uh -huh. I don't, ha. Uh, even me, I don't even understand. Uh, me too. Me too. I don't understand. I, I understand. Then Let's go. He promised to help. Uh -huh. Yes. <laughs> you know, after telling him everything, he uh -huh. promised to help. Uh -huh. So the thing now is, Chike, uh -huh. I want you, when you get into your room, uh -huh. carefully think of a viable business okay. that you can make money from. So that when he comes tomorrow, you have something to present to him. Wait, sister, this man said you should tell your brother to think of viable business that he can do. I, we are there already now. We are there. I, I, I said it. I said it. No problem. If it's about the business, I know. I know. I know the business I want to do, but <laughs> uh, I also know the business this man is coming for in your side. Chiki, 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 can you stop? I don't know why your body is always doing you shasha, shasha, shasha like this. Uh, if uh, you may know, that man is married. Yes. Uh. And I don't have any business with any married man. I know you now. If it's that one, no problem. I know the business I want to do. I know the business I want to do. I know the business. I know the business. Fast and sharp. I know. There's no problem. Uh, <laughs> I know the business. <laughs> it's a married man. There's no problem. I, 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 I know the business. I know the business, sister. Chike, Chike, please. Yes. <laughs> Chike. Uh. Chike. Sister. Chike. Sister. <laughs> Hey, yeah, I know the business. This is the second chance I am giving you. I know, I know, I know, I know. The truth of the matter is that this man wanted to help me. Yeah. Yes. Oh. But I said no. That he should help you instead. So please, I, I want you to think about it. My own is just think, think, and come up with something tangible. There's no problem. Something you're sure we are going to make money from. There's no from. problem. This business will make money from this business. It's are you already, sure? It's here. It's here, sister. There's no problem. I know the business. So, do you, do you want to tell me about it first? Sister, I let the man come first. I know the business. I know the... Just calm down. Calm down. Let yeah. him come. Ah, sister! Ah, it's ah. a very good business. Beautiful business, sister. Ah, how come you didn't tell me now? Let's sister, see let this man come now. Let me surprise you. Ah, yeah. ah, ah, ah. I know okay. the business. Just, ah. just think well, Lord. Think well. <laughs> I, I know the business I want to do, sister. I'm happy. I'm just happy that you're going to be happy that this man is not coming to try any... He's not trying anything. He's married. And me, I don't have any business with a married man. I trust you on that one. Okay. So I trust you. But the business, I know the business I want to do. There's no problem. I know the business. You know the business. I know the business. And it's a good business. Ah! And it will fetch us more money. Sister, there's no problem. Let him come. My love. Yes, baby. Tell me. When do you want a traditional marriage to be and uh, how big do you want it? Baby, did you just ask me how big I want it to be? Of course. I mean, who wouldn't want a big traditional marriage? Mm. <laughs> Baby, I want it to be very big, mm -hmm. elaborate, <laughs> and exaggerated <laughs> traditional marriage. That's what I want. 
look, mm -hmm. I want to shake this community. I want them to know that mm -hmm. <laughs> if I want to set a standard, maybe, I mean, wh why not? If we can afford it, I want it big. Oh. Very big, oh. <laughs> okay. Oh, come on, if you look at them. Hmm? Okay, um, regarding what you said, you want it big, so. Mm -hmm. Start your preparations and um, tell me, do you have any musician in mind? Any good one you want? Make a choice, let me know how we afford it. Chilu. A Nigerian famous artist. Oh, uh, sure. At my traditional marriage. It's your day, your happiness is my concern. This community. <laughs> you guys are in soup. <laughs> <laughs> See, eh, I will set a standard. Uh huh. That's. <laughs> it's okay. Mm. It's alright. Mm. I can't wait. Um, so, baby, um, so I can start. Start preparations, whatever you need. Drop your budget, let me know what you want, and um, I'll give you the money to start up immediately. <gasps> Oh my god. Okay. Come Don't be here. happy. It's Come here, baby. Give me a big hug. I love you. I love you too, honey. I love you, you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you, baby. It's okay. Come here. I love you. I love you too. <laughs> Are they ready? I just want hey, to be happy. It's your day, okay? Baby. Bring this down the roof that very day. They are not ready for me yet, so uh -huh. they are not ready. Chicken. Yes, sir. Like I was saying, your sister has told me everything about your family. Yes, sir. I had pity on her. I wanted to help her. She now okay. says I should transfer the opportunity to you. I want to help your sister. I pray that both of you to become somebody in life. Thanks. That's why I'm here. Thanks. So, Chica, tell me, what kind of business do you like to do? Sir, so I already know the business I want to do. I know that has always been in my mind. I would like to go into female. Um, things, female clothes, female fashion. Yes, like shoes, bags, clothes, you know, bra, pants. And uh, I don't want pants again because girls don't wear pants again. So I, I, I prefer shoes, bags, you know, clothes. You stop at bra. Yes, small quantity. Chiki, chiki, chiki. Yes. Why do you want to go into this kind of business? Sister, this thing moves now. It moves now. Uh -uh. Uh, what does this move? Except pants now. That doesn't move anyhow. Because girls don't wear pants again. Well, how how did you know that girls no longer wear pants? I leave this talk first, bros. It's okay. Uh, no, no, sir. Leave leave this talk now. now. Is this what you want us to say in here? Okay. But I know they don't wear pants now. Girls don't wear pants again now. Do you okay. still wear pants? You see, you see, you see, you see. You're so, very stupid. You would have come to check now. They it's don't fine. Wear pants again. Bros, I beg. Uh, sorry. It's not a bad business. Oh. But chicken, sir, do you have any idea about the business? So, you know, I used to be in the university until I dropped out, um, but I used to be around girls, so I know that, you know, all these things, shoes, bags, all these things they, they wear, you know, they used to change a lot. But you see, pants business has slowed down now because they don't wear pants again. Chicken, so chicken, bags, uh, chicken, chicken, please wait. S sorry, sir, I'm so sorry. How did you know that girls no longer wear pants? Because you're so particular about it. I leave this talk, I beg. I leave this talk, I beg. All right. Bro, all right. Sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. Uh, I think I have a very good friend, or even friends, that import those goods from abroad. Yes, yeah, yes. Okay. Yes, sir. I'm going to introduce you to them. Thank you, sir. So as soon as their container arrives, yes, sir. you come and choose the one you want. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Meanwhile, yes, sir. as soon as you get to the city, yes, sir. I will give you three million naira. Sir! Just for a start. Sir! Hey! Sir! Thank you, 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 sir! Thank you
to be yourself. You see this old, this man, he's got sent to this family. Because now, don't make him regret stepping his feet into this he family. Won't, he won't, he won't, Pico, he won't. He won't. Just make us fr proud. You have seen everything now. Make us proud. There's no problem. Don't go there and be looking at women. Stop, stop this talk now. I'm, I'm, no, I'm serious. Stop, stop I'm, I'm serious. Stop now. This is how you were saying stop now, but I have to I have to tell stop, you. Stop, stop now. It's your sister that will tell you that your mouth know, is smelling. So okay now working now. Okay. Because for the car, you have a weakness when in, in that side. Are you through? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I hope you are not forgetting anything. Ah, uh, no, sir, no, sir. <laughs> Take your time and arrange your things. Uh, sir, everything I'm fine. I'm fine. What's in my bag? Okay. Yes, Put your bag in the box. Yes, sir. Ah, Thank you, sir. Thank you. I do good. Sir. You're a nice person. Thank you, sir. As you gave your opportunity to your brother, God will reward you. Amen. Thank you. Well, it's better to bless you. Amen. Amen. Thank you. Amen. Thank you so much. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Just, just looking, no. I do good. This is 200,000 Naira. You can take it and help yourself, okay? Hey. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Hey. May God bless you. After helping my brother, Chike, you still... <laughs> it's fine. Yeah. Come up, come up, please, come up. God bless Thank you, sir. sir. Thank you, sir. Please help yourself, okay? Thank you. Thank, Thank you, sir. you so much. God Thank bless you, you. Whatever you lay your hands on, you shall prosper. Amen. 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 Okay, Amen. God bless you. Amen. Amen. Take good care of yourself, okay? I sure Amen. will. Thank you so Let's much. Let's go. Please, 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 don't make him regret no. stepping his feet into his knees. Have some wine, yeah? Oh, just Don't look at girls. Don't look at them. Just don't look at them. Chicky, but I'll miss you. I'll miss you. Come and hug me now. Okay. I'll miss you. All right. You take care of yourself. I'll call you. Yes, thank you. Right. Please, don't talk to women. Girls, don't talk to women. Thank you. Just too much. Hey, look at this. You see the confusion. Okay. <laughs> but we're settled on the material. Yes. yes. That's the color we're using, right? Yes. Okay, see, I think at this point, I'll just let you both decide what you want to wear. As for me, <laughs> I have my stars already in my head. I don't even I won't let this magazine confuse me. So just decide. Decide. Let's know what what you girls are wearing. At least the two of you can decide for the other for the other girls. See, anyone you pick is fine. Mm. This ties are fantastic. Look at this. Very, Very nice. nice. Oh I, my I like this so one. gorgeous. 
Wow. Yeah. See, um, have we resolved on the material? Is that the material we're using? Yes. What about the yeah. color? Are we retaining the that color? The color is fine. Yeah. Okay, now it's just the style. The style. Okay, that's fine. We have that's loads what, to choose from. That's where the problem is. Fine. No, I don't think it's a See, problem. Just put your mind to something. Like, I mean, as for me, oh, <laughs> I'm not hey. worried. Because all the styles I want to wear, I am not exporting from any magazine. <laughs> I am creating in my head. <laughs> Are you serious? I'm shocking. Hey. Don't worry. Hey. Are you girls still confused? Please yeah. make a pit now. Babes, like serious. I'm confused. Huh. All these styles are very, very beautiful. I know. Like seriously, I don't know what to choose. You know what? Looking at this magazine will make us more confused. I think we should just pick anyone. Okay, so what are you going to do? Let's just call the other girls and tell them we are both choosing one. Okay, fine. They are all fine. Fine. See, I really don't mind though. Anything, so long as it's that color, like, anything you want is okay by me. All these styles, they are fine. They are okay, beautiful. Okay, can you fine. Talk? Call them. They can Let me judge you for this. See, right? I think if you decide between this and this, is fine. Whichever. Either yeah. because your material, can you Okay, say? okay. If you are talking about this now, what of what of this? How many styles you want? Oh, yeah. This is your way to me. This is your way to me. This is your Welcome, Daddy. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. Welcome, baby. Yeah, how are you? Okay, how's work? Very well. Oh, how are you doing? I'm good. <laughs> Who are they? Um, my girls. My friends, do you know, um, as regards their Shribi? Oh, yeah. So these are the girls representing the other girls. Oh, okay. So we're just trying to have a meeting to decide which fabric, color, style for the okay. girls. Yeah. It's okay. So that's what we're doing. It's okay. Uh, darlings, you guys are not saying hello to my husband. <laughs> yeah, he's already <laughs> beaten. <laughs> How are you? Fine, sir. It's okay. Welcome, sir. Welcome, sir. Thank you. Okay, so, uh, baby, we have done a lot of research okay and um accumulatively mm -hmm. we'll be needing about a hundred and ninety five thousand naira okay to get the materials All right. uh, baby you know you promised you're going to don't worry don't worry i'll give you the money okay get the materials and share for them okay <laughs> My darling, <laughs> guess what? My husband said you uh, girls will not be paying for the Ashwabi. He's yeah. buying it for us. Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> thank you, sir. 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 Alright, okay. right, love you too, sir. Yeah. So you guys are not paying. Come on, she's like you're in the Ashwabi. I said, please, anybody can join you. Hey, I mean, the price is not going to cost you anything. Come on, sir. Come on, sir. Come on, sir. My husband is so wonderful. She's so nice. Condition na him make her a feel she bent. Where's her She can walk her. Mwa wapa luma lu. She can walk day and night for the sake of him bright. What I love. I follow one day and day. She loves him so much. She the sacrifice for him any kind of way. She got the money. Congratulations, young lady. Doctor, why are you congratulating me? A sick person. What's going on? Uh, you're 16 weeks pregnant. That's your test result. What? Yes. this happen? Are you sure there is no mix-up in this? No. But why are you worried? You're supposed to be happy. What of your husband? Doctor. I 
want to be left alone. You want to be left alone? Are you sure? Are you okay? I am okay. Okay, if, if you say so. Nurse, please, um, just let her be, okay? But make sure you come and check on her regularly, okay? Yes, doctor. It's right. Hello? Benson. I want to see you. I want to see you now. I am at the City Gates Hospital. Benson, please stop asking me all these questions. I want to see you. If you don't come here now, I'll, I'll, I'll come to your house from here. Is the meaning of this pregnant pregnant for who what sort of question is that eh? you've seen it that I am pregnant and all you could ask me is for who okay if you may know it's for you are you now satisfied? I do go. I do go. What have I done to you? Why do you want to do this to me? See that question you're asking me? I should be the one asking you. I done to you? No, answer me. What have I done to you? Ever since I met you, my life has not been the same again. It's been one problem to another. First, you took away my virginity. And now, just, just look at this condition you have put me. And you stand there to ask me for who? Benson. You will probably be mad. I don't go. Let's not to overflow this issue. Please. We'll have to look for a way forward. Because I am getting married in the next two weeks to Sandra. And I wouldn't want anything to be a hindrance to my marriage with Sandra. You are heartless. I just told you I am pregnant. All you could do is to stand here and tell me about your traditional marriage to some Sandra. Ah, Benson, what did I ever do wrong to you? No, tell me, what, what did I do wrong but, to but you? It's okay, it's okay, so what do we do? Just come and see my people. I mean, do the necessary things and, and take me home. <laughs> this sounds so funny, you know. Uh, come and see my people. Uh, uh, do the necessary thing and take me home. Wait a minute. Are you in any way referring to me getting married to you? Oh, yes. Oh yes, Benson. 
Because I am not going to give birth to a bastard in my father's house. Oh, that is never going to happen. Mamma I'll see you later. Matter. Are you okay? You've been pacing around. Benson, are you okay? Talk to me now. What is it? What bothers you? Your problem is my problem. Baby, talk to me. Are you okay? If you don't want to talk to me, come on, talk to me now. Ha! Mama! Mama! Mama, please come. I don't know what is wrong with Benson. I've been, I've been asking him. He, he's not talking to me. What is wrong with you? So what is it? Huh? He has been like this. What is worrying you? Talk to us now. Huh? Benson. You see? He's not talking. He, he has been like this. He, he's not talking. Mom, talk to me. Mama is talking to you now. Answer her now. Um, uh, my dear, please give me just a second. Let me see if he can talk to me. Please. Hey. Yes. It's fine. It's fine. So, what is it? What? She's pregnant. Who? Sandra. Is that why you are worried? Oh my goodness. I, I thought something has gone wrong going now. I, I don't understand. You're supposed to be celebrating. It calls for celebration. Congratulations, son. I am so happy. Mom, stop. I mean, Adugo is pregnant. What? Which Adugo? The one you know. Mom, and I slept with her once. Just only once. So she called me right now and told me that she's pregnant, that she's in the hospital. If I refuse to come to the hospital, she will come to this house. So I went to the hospital to see her. Only for her to give me the lab result that shows that she is pregnant. And she insisted that I must come to marry her. Never! I said, never! That will never happen. She can never step her feet into this compound. And let me tell you, you might not be responsible for that pregnancy. Oh, yes. She's just shifting it to you to lure you into marrying her. Can't you sense it? God. So, which hospital is she? City Gate Hospital. City Gate Hospital. City Gate. Yes. Hospital. Yeah. yeah. I, I, I remember. Let me change. Let me change my clothes. Let me change. Respect of the lady in your hospital by the name Adugo. Oh, um, the pregnant lady. Exactly. Is she your son's wife? No. That girl is just a gold digger. 
She wants to push that pregnancy to my son because my son is rich. Mom, what exactly can I do for you here? My son is about to do his traditional marriage. And I don't want anything to stand up his way. And as I can see, that girl is about to come out and hook my son with that pregnancy. Uh, madam, if your son is responsible for this lady's pregnancy, why don't you allow him to take up the responsibility? Oh, 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 no, 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 please, doctor, don't just go there. I am very, very sure that that pregnancy does not belong to my son. Yes. For that, I am ready to offer you 500,000 Naira to terminate that pregnancy. What? Yes. 500,000 Naira. Forward me your account details. Let me do the transfer here and now. But well, madam, I, I can't do this. It's against the actions of my profession. My goodness. See who is talking. Doctor. Are you talking about ethics of your profession? Have you forgotten that I know you too well? Do you want me to tell people who you are? Eh? Are you ready to do it or not? Um, Madam, your account details, doctor. Still like this? Why are you still crying? After you stop worrying yourself, okay? If you keep on doing this to yourself, you might end up having high blood pressure or even stroke. Please, stop worrying yourself. I'm going to send the nurse over to give you some injections so that you can calm yourself and sleep, okay? Please, stop worrying yourself, okay? Just lie down, okay? Lie down, okay? It's okay. You'll be fine, eh? Just lie down, okay? Please. Sorry about that. It's okay. It's going to be fine. It's going to be fine, okay? The nurse is coming right now, okay? Sorry.
sent for the both of you. Um, we have a problem. Problem? Yes. The problem is um, we're having some complications. Complications? What kind of complications are you talking about? The lady is seriously bleeding. And if we don't do anything about it, she might die. What? So, what do we do? Well, the only alternative is to use the sucking machine to suck out all the blood in her womb. But if we make any mistake and the needle touches her womb, it's going to damage her womb and she won't be able to get pregnant again. And who cares? Doctor, I don't care. Anyhow you want to do it, do it. Even if it warrants damaging her womb, so be it. I will give you more money. Ah, uh, doctor, you just heard what my mother said, okay? Go ahead, uh, do anything and damn more any kind of consequences. We don't care. Yeah? After all, she, she, she's not my wife. Yeah, uh, she's not his wife. Okay, fine. I will do that. But you have to give me another 500,000. And then the next one over the job is done. No problem. Money is not the problem. Just go ahead and do it. I will do the transfer now. It's alright. Doctor. What, what did you say happened to me? You had a miscarriage. We almost lost you. But I had to use all my medical experience on you and that was why we were able to save you. You, you see the reason why I told you not to be worrying yourself, right? Eh? It, 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 it actually affected you. But anyway, thank God we actually saved you and, and you're fine now. You're okay now. You mean I lost my pregnancy and and my baby? You did. I'm so sorry. Benson. Benson. Shall never be well with you. Benson. You will never hear the cry of a baby in your home. people I have a brother who knows what he's doing in <laughs> fact who knows what time it is ah chicken 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 this is beautiful I love it ah, this is beautiful yes, thank yes, you thank yes. you so much thank you it's okay thank god chicken. don't worry don't worry chicken, thank don't you worry. thank you I love it <laughs> don't worry by the time you come to the city yeah you know chelo, stay with chelo, me chelo, chelo. yes 
did you say by the time I come to the city, like, are you planning to take me to your house? Of course, of course, you have to leave here and come to the city now. What are we talking about? Just give me two months to tidy up one or two things in my house, and then you'll come over. Then <laughs> people will not recognize you again. Trust me. <laughs> <Chiki>. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yes. Thank you. But um, that will not be necessary. Yes, you know, I, I told you something on the phone, right? If you still remember. Somebody will be coming to ask for my hand in marriage next week. Are you serious? Yes. Are you serious? I'm dead serious. <laughs> I mean, why is everything happening at the same time now? H how do you mean? Well, I found the girl I want to marry too. <laughs> she can you? Yes, and I'll see her people next to me. You have found a girl? Of course. Oh my <laughs> God, I thank you. But wait, 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 wait. Is she beautiful? Ah, you trust me. Trust me. Yeah, she she's beautiful. beautiful. Congratulations in yes, advance. Yes. Oh, I thank yes, you. Yes, yes. I thank you for the way you have blessed yes, this family. Yes, yes. You, you finally remembered us. I remembered us. See yes, how yes. you have blessed my brother. Yes. He is now very wealthy. He even came back with a big car. Exactly. Now he has found a wife to marry. Yes. I mean, ah, God, <laughs> it can only be you. Thank I you. Thank don't you. Not joy. Not joy. Are you sure? Because you, joy. that girl that ate you all your money. Not joy. Not <laughs> joy. Not joy. Chicky, thank you so yeah. much. Amame benge bido bido. Amame benge bido bido. Amame benge bido bido. Wenjawa chine kemao. Hey, no, Chicky, I have to wear this one. Hey, when are you taking me out? Amame benge bido bido. Amame benge bido bido. Amame benge bido bido. Wenjawa chine kemao. Ah, Chicky, okay, I hear people can't walk. I'll also, show them in this video. What's what? No, chicken, chicken, no, no, no. Ah, uh -uh. what is all that? Chicken. Uh? Show your opinion to the city. Ha! Huh. You haven't seen anything. Are you serious? Yeah, I see them do this now, so. <laughs> ah! Chicken. Now you have really proven to me that you know what women want. Of course, mm? now, of course. Eh? But this is not the only business I do. Really. Oh, really? Uh, Tell me. I... So, wait, 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 wait. I hope it's not pants business. Or have you. Uh, You've actually you stopped know, all the things. I bought, you know, wine, you know, different you know, varieties of wine. And Importer. We keep trying. Export. We just try. We just try. We just try. Yeah, sister, me. Everything is soft now. Everything I can see that. Everything is soft too. Even your skin, everything, director. You Benson. I am worried. Worried? Worried about what, mom? Are you not worried about your wife? <laughs> mom, I, I am bothered, but what can I do? Benson, you have a lot to do, unless you are not a man. Oh, come on, mom. I am a man, and of course you know that. Have you forgotten that I got Adugo pregnant years back? That means your wife is the problem. You have to do something. Something like what? You need to take her to see a doctor. I'm guessing you have to do something before it is too late. Mama, I think, I think you have a point there. Do you know I've not really thought about that for once? Excuse me.
Baby. Baby, is anything the matter? Baby, are you okay? I want you to get prepared. Let's go to the hospital. For what? Who is sick? Both of us. Both of us are sick. Sick? But I'm fine. Or oh, are you sick? And you are not fine. You are not. You are not fine. It's more than two years we got married and there's no sign of procreation. Have you ever tried to find out why? Have you ever tried to find out what the problem could be? From your calculation, do you think we are fine? Sandra, one of us is sick. We need to see the doctor. In that case, then, I I think we should, we should get ready to go. Good. So, get ready, let's go. Well, Mr. and Mrs. Benson in Fedora, I went through your lab results and I found that there's nothing wrong with both of you. The results we ran on you shows that you're perfectly okay. If we're okay like you just said right now, then what could be the cause of our childlessness? We've been married for over two years now. There's no sign of pregnancy, not even miscarriage. Well, you both should relax your mind and calm down. Things like this happen sometimes. Some people got married and stayed for like five years, ten years, and couldn't even get pregnant. God forbid. God forbid. It is not my portion in Jesus' name. Amen. Did I just hear you say five years and ten years? Oh my God. I believe that my God will not keep me waiting for five years or ten years before he blesses me with my own child. Amen. It's not my portion. Amen. God forbid. Uh, doctor, please, what can we do to save this situation? Uh, I prescribe some drugs for the both of you. I believe by the time you're done taking these drugs, you'll have smiles on your faces. But while you're taking these drugs, please, you have to pray. It is very important that you pray. Okay. Um, please, um, doctor, can we get these drugs in any nearby pharmacy? Of course, you can get them. They're everywhere. You can. All right. Thank you so much, Doctor. Uh, well, I, I have to be on my way. All right. Thank you very much. Thank you. Okay. Have a nice day. Thank you, Ma. I don't understand. How do you mean the doctor said there's nothing wrong with you and your wife? And what could be the problem if nothing is wrong? Eh? And he said you people should keep on praying. When did the doctor become a pastor that gives people prayer point? Uh, Mom, I, I don't know. Honestly, I don't know. Oh? Does it mean your wife is from a marine kingdom? Mom, I, are you asking me that question? Mom, I should be the one asking you that question because you're supposed to be in a better position to know that. Because you brought her from nowhere and imposed her on me. You insisted that I must marry. That I must marry her. I was madly in love with Adugo. I brought Adugo, but you kicked against it. You said, no, you do not want Adugo. Mom, she took him from me. You connected with the doctor and terminated the pregnancy. Now you stand here and ask me if my wife is, is from the Marine Kingdom. Mom, you are supposed to answer that question.
Martin. What did you say? It? Mm -mm. Well, that is, you don't want to try. Mm. Oh. <laughs> so, honey, mm -hmm. you really, really surprised me. During our traditional marriage, mm. I didn't know you know a lot of people like that. See the way they were just spraying me. 1,000 naira notes. They were just spraying, spraying. You, you, you deserve more than that. No, my celeb. <laughs> I'm, I'm not the loud type. It's so obvious. But I have them. <laughs> Big and mighty. It's so obvious. Let, let me just give you one uh, promise. Tell you me. You see, in this house, any celebration in this house, oh. I'm going to pull men really? from all over. <laughs> you see, mm. our first child's birthday. You tell me. I will surprise you. Really? For sure. For okay, sure. maybe we should just have an agreement. All right? Okay, go on. Um. What if it's a baby girl? What will you do? You give me a baby girl? Yeah. I'll give you a Venza. What Venza? I don't want Venza. Latest model? I don't like Venza. Ah. Alright, alright. <laughs> Tell okay. me what you want. Moving on. Um, mm. What if it's a baby boy? What will you do? Mm. If you give me a baby boy, yes. you're going on vacation. Vacation? Yeah. Where? Where? Your choice. Mauritius? Consider it done. Ma Mauritius? Oh my god! In fact, I'm pregnant. Seriously? I am pregnant! I'm the pregnant! And it's a baby boy! Mm. 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 My husband, he traveled um, to Port Harcourt oh. for a business meeting. Oh my God. Come on. Mm -hmm. My God. <laughs> ah, see my sister talking. What, my what sister is this? is talking. I can see this man is spending his money on you. Right? The money is speaking. I mean, look at you now. Good money. But for real, Auntie, marriage looks good on you. I'm telling Thank you. you. But hey, that is what happens when you're happy you're married. You, you just glow effortlessly. Yeah, you just, you just glow. You know? <laughs> look at that. Look at it. Look at Look at She's even blushing. Ah, she's in love now. She's in love. You don't know what that man does to me, don't you? Who shot it? Oh my God. And um, please don't don't mind him. Mm. See, this is my brother. Mm. He's very very naughty. Know, right? <laughs> so how have you been managing him? Hmm? Tell me. Mm. <clears throat> how have you been coping? In fact, just tell me. Okay. Mm -hmm. He's quite stubborn. Oh, that I that's one I know now. Oh yeah, but, but, but he's caring. Ah, Chike, Kerry, how? Yes. And see, so he takes good care of me. Tell her. Do you know that he <laughs> brings me breakfast in bed? Oh, yeah? Yes. No, wait, 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 wait. wait. I'm serious. Chike brings you what? Breakfast in bed? Yes. Chike, I don't understand. When did you learn how to cook? I've always known how to cook. He's, He's let me a very good cook. Oh. What kind of food does he cook? He boils water no. and makes... <laughs> good food. Tell like pando, pepper soup... Chike, you, you. I'm serious. <laughs> so how come you never cooked for me? Well, because you were always underrating me. <laughs> yes. No, uh, yes. Auntie, of auntie, 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 you know when a man is in love, oh. that is when you will see his true character. Tell her. He loves me so <laughs> much. That's why he's taking good care of me. So you mean to say because Chike is in love with you, <laughs> he had to go and learn how to cook, no, right? No, no, I've always known how to cook. No, 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 no. I have always mm -mm. known how to you cook. You never cooked for me, no, Chike. No, why would I cook for you when we're always bullying me? Me bullying yes, you? never said anything right to me. In fact, I'm going to tell you about this, your husband. Stop, 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 stop. Please, we are hungry. I will come to your house no, today I'm now. Going to say, we came to your house today. Say, Look. No. Benson, Sandra, what is it? Why are your faces like this? Mama, I'm tired. Mama, I don't know what is happening. 
And what is the problem? What happened? Mama went to a different hospital to consult another doctor. He said the same thing. He said she is okay. In as much as I tried to let him know that we, we've suffered, we've done everything humanly possible to know if she's going to procreate, he said that, that, that she, she, she's okay. I said, okay, fine. Look for a way, give her drugs so she can take and conceive. He said he's not going to give us any drugs, that, that she's okay. Mama, I, I, I am tired. Sandra, what do you have to say about this whole thing? I have nothing to say, Mom. I mean, what can I say? My husband has said it all. And that's exactly what the doctor said. That I don't even need drugs. And yet, I'm childless. I don't even know the reason for my childlessness. I'm tired. I'm tired of the whole thing. It's really getting to me. I cannot concentrate. I can't do anything. I can't sleep well at night. I can barely eat well. I don't understand why I'm going through this. I'm confused. Oh my God. What have I done? What have I done to deserve this? Let me join her upstairs. What is happening in my family? Something is wrong somewhere. How cannot the doctors be saying one thing? That nothing is wrong with my son and his wife. I know my son is okay. Because he has impregnated a woman before. No. No. I know something is wrong with Sandra. She has a problem. Yes. And I will not allow this to continue. I must do something before she ruins my son's life. I must do something. Me. I was just, I was just about to take a nap. What did I hear you say? Have a seat. I was, I was just about to take a nap before you called. Did I hear you well? I, I thought you said you don't sleep. <laughs> Much reason. What kind of relaxed mind do you have to take a nap? When there is a big problem in your marriage. Eh? My goodness. Come on. Sandra. Are you possessed? I'm asking you. Are you possessed that you cannot get pregnant for my son? Why do you want to destroy him? Did I hear you well? Did you just ask me if I'm possessed? How? I mean, how is this my problem? Did anyone say this is my problem? Did yes. you also say I am the problem? Yes! You are the problem. How? Because my son is okay. I remember he once impregnated. Anyway, that is not your business. Go and check yourself. As you can see, you have a problem. But the doctor said that I'm fine. They're lying. You're not fine. Go and check yourself very well. Before I do something you will not like. I can't 
can't believe this. I can't believe you're telling me this. The doctor said I'm fine. We went to the hospital together with my husband. I'm fine. That is even you. Or rather you bribed them. <laughs> you better do something. Tell yourself the truth. Before I do what you will not like. I've said it over and over. Do something, oh. Tell yourself the truth, oh. Mm. Hey. Already there. Yeah, it's your easy. Don't take step by step. Step by step. Stop easy. telling me step by step. Easy. Stop it. Easy. Easy. Ah. It's okay. It's just step by step. Ah. Just step by remember. To good girl, that's my ah. girl, that's my girl. Good, 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 good. We're there, we're there, we're there. Just keep going. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep going. Good, good, good. Your waist is in order. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Your waist is, your waist is in order, my love. Your waist is in order. Come on, let's do this. Let's do this. Let's go. Let's go. Good, 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 good. We're just gonna put this back on the car, okay? Good, good, good. So just keep going, keep going. Okay, okay, my love, please, okay, 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 yes, we're there, 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 we're there. My God. What is happening to me? Since I got married to my husband, I haven't seen any sign of pregnancy. I have gone to so many doctors and none of them is telling me what I want to hear. And my husband is no longer taking it funny. My brother that I got married before him now has children. What do I do now? Does it mean the miscarriage I had in the past affected me indirectly? No. No. That is just a miscarriage. It, it doesn't contribute anything to my problem. Oh God. Please help me. I do not want to lose my marriage. Even if it's one child that you give to me, I, I don't mind. Just wipe away these tears from my eyes. Please God, please. I've asked you this question many times. Say, or now you have not given me any answer. This is three years my son got married to you. Say, or now you have nothing to show in this marriage. Nothing at all. Now I ask you again. Are you possessed? I'm asking you. Are you possessed? Have you come to destroy or to save? Eh? I am not possessed. I am not. I'm fine. No, you are not fine. Sandra, you are not fine. There is no sign in you that shows that you are fine. You are not. Is it when my son is up to 15 years that you are going to give him a child? When is he going to train his children and his children will train him in return? I'm asking you. Let me sound this as a note of warning to you. If by two months from now, I do not see any sign of pregnancy in you, Sandra, I will throw you out of this house. I will push you out of my son's life and bring another wife for him before you kill him. Nonsense. Now get out! Get out! I am not God! I am not Shut God! Shut up! 
Shut your useless mouth up. Good for nothing idiot. You want to kill my son and I with your one You know it will not work. I can't sit down here and watch you do that. Nonsense. Now get out. Get out! Get out! Nonsense. Out! Fully. Peter, I cannot even lie to you. I am tired. I am beyond tired. See, you don't know what this my childlessness is making me go through in the hands of my mother-in-law. She... Look. There is no sort of insult she has not used on me. There is no abusive word she has not used on me. In fact, to the extent that she said that I'm possessed. I'm tired. <laughs> Honestly. What is your husband saying about this? That one. Is that one a man? He's not saying anything about it. Or he's not even doing anything about it. As a matter of fact, whatever his mother says goes. Are you serious? Uh -huh. <laughs> what kind of a man is he? <laughs> oh, you're still calling him a man. A that, man that cannot uh -huh. make decisions for himself. My dear, that one is not a man. That one is a boy. A toy. The mother controls him at will. The mother goes left, he goes left. The mother goes right, he feels right. On his own, he cannot even... He doesn't even have a mind of his own. It's so, serious. I don't know. I don't know. That is not even the bone of contention. My mother-in-law has given me two months. Ultimatum. She said, at the end of two months... <laughs> If there's no sign of pregnancy, she'll kick me out and get another wife for her son. Wait. <laughs> Wait, Sandra. Are you kidding me? My dear, I'm not. So I wish I am. Has it got into that extent? That is where I am right now. I'm at a crossroad. It's either I get pregnant in two months or I'm out of that house. And as for my <laughs> husband, I don't even worry about him because he's not going to say anything. He's not even going to try to stop his mother. <laughs> um, Sandra, since this whole issue is getting out of hand, I will take it to my pastor. Once we get there, he's going to give solutions to your problems. Be rest assured. What am I waiting for? Please, when are you taking me? Mm. All I want now is solution. All anywhere there is solution, that is where I want to be. Sandra, don't worry. You will get your solutions right away. Oh God. Let's go. Please, let's go. Sister Sandra, as we were praying, the Lord opened my eyes to the mystery that is behind your childlessness. Your husband was involved with a lady called Adugo, who later got pregnant for him. Your mother-in-law connived with a doctor and had her pregnancy aborted without the lady's knowledge. In the process of the abortion, her womb was damaged. Adugo placed a curse on your husband and the curse is the reason both of you cannot have any child. Sandra, I know you're actually thinking about a lot now, but you just have to calm down. Everything will be fine. Just, just have faith. Believe in God. Hmm? It's okay. Dressed this morning and stepped out. 
did she tell you where she was going? Not at all. She didn't even talk to me. She just walked out. Mm -hmm. I sense danger. Benson, I sense danger. Your wife has started running after men. And when a woman starts running after men, her husband's life is in danger. I will never allow that woman to kill you. My first son. That will never happen. So if she comes back and cannot defend herself on where she went to. Girl, you wanted to watch Benson, shameless man. Aduga is the girl I wanted to. Aduga is a poor girl. An innocent girl that you here got pregnant. So yes, you got her pregnant and this evil woman called your mother connived with a doctor and had her baby aborted. Oh, you're acting shocked. Didn't you? Why are you, why are you acting surprised? You, you, you made sure you had her baby aborted. And as a result of that, Aduko lost her womb. Yes! That time Aduko is in her husband's house now, childless, barren, because she doesn't have a womb. Due to the wickedness and evil of your mother, you and your mother, evil people, that's what you are. The good news is that Aduko laid a curse on you. Yes! Aduko laid a curse on you both. That is why you are suffering childlessness. Oh yes! Uh -huh. Do you have a child of your own? Of course you cannot! Why would you? Uh, honey, mm. I, it's not what you think. Okay. Uh, my mother that caused it, I, I wanted Mama, to... Keep quiet! Please keep quiet and stop pissing me off! What is wrong with you? At your old age, you cannot take decisions for yourself. If my mother says, my, my, my mother, mother, mommy's boy. No, 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 mommy's toy. That's what you are. A full grown man that cannot stamp his feet on the ground and take decision. I mean, life changing decision is a toy. What am I married to? A man or a toy? That is what you are. Evil people. Evil. See, <laughs> let me tell you. If you see me, Sandra, in this your house in the next 20 25 minutes, then I'm a bastard, which I'm not. Excuse me. Evil people. What? You're not saying anything. Are you okay now? No, are you satisfied now? I expected you to say something, but you didn't say anything. Honey? Honey, uh, let me explain to you, honey. Hold on. Better go and pack and get more. Go and get more of this. What is the effect of all this? You're taking. I need kids. I need kids. Stop deceiving yourself. Huh? Is it a crime to hear the voices of kids in this house? Huh? To hear those little voices come, Daddy, you're welcome. Is it a crime? Haven't I waited enough? Haven't I waited enough? And they keep on honeying me. What is what is so sweet in that your honey? If actually you mean that thing, you would have done something and get the kids. Okay, relax. Give me a child. Leave those Just give me one. I'm not asking too much. And you're here taking drugs with my money. No results. I don't want me to be happy. Time. 
fix what? Time is what I asked for. You can Please. fix what, Benson? You can fix what? Hey, I am not going to be a part of your cursed life. Cursed man, evil woman. Let me tell you, you see that evil that you and your mother orchestrated, you are going to rip the fruit of your labor. You are going to enjoy the consequences. Evil people. Honey, God, hold on, hold on. Please, please. See. Honey, let's go. Touch my box. Try me again. Touch my box. Nonsense. We get people. God will punish you. Honestly, I am tired. I don't even know what to do again. Because of this problem now, my husband is no longer comfortable with me. See, it has gotten to the point that if he comes back from work and I welcome him, he, he just ignores me as if I don't even exist. Since this problem started, uh, have both of you gone anywhere for help? We've been to different hospitals and all of them keep saying the same thing, which is that nothing is wrong with us. Chike, I don't know again, like I don't know what to do. If the doctors keep saying the same thing, then what could be the problem? Honestly, I don't know. Her mom. With due respect, I'll ask you this question. I'm a man. I, I know men. You know. Look, is your husband a man? No, seriously, because because some men can be very funny. A man can know he has a problem, but he'll keep it to himself and apportion the blames on his wife. This question you're asking me, what am I going to ask? See, right now, I don't even know anything. A mom, anything. I, I don't know. But the thing is that um, I, I told one of my friends about it. She said there is a place she will take me to. And this place, whatever problems the doctors cannot solve, can be solved there. And that is going to be my last bus stop. But now she's she's not back from her trip, so I'm just just waiting for her to come back. Once she comes back, then we'll go to the place. Let me know now if that's really going to be my final bus stop because Chiki, I am tired. Okay. When you go to this place uh, with your friend and come back, I you will do something for me. And, and what is that? You relax. It's okay. You just have to have a relaxed mind. There's no problem in the world that doesn't have a solution. No problem in the world that doesn't have circumvention. You just have to relax. It's okay. I'm just praying that God will help me. So that at the end of the day, all this will just be history. Amen. Amen. Because I don't, I don't even know what to do again. It will pass. Amen. Amen. Chike, I, I have to be on my way now. Okay. My regards to your family when they get back. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Thank you so much. They're just relax. Thank you. Relax. Thank you. Relax. Every problem has a solution. Yeah. Huh? Um, good afternoon. Please, I was directed here. I'm Sandra by name, and I'm looking for Adugu. It's very important that I see her. Where is she? Okay, my name is Rita. I'm Adugu's cousin. Okay. The thing is, Adugu no longer stays in the village. She now stays in the city with her husband. Um, okay, is there, is there a possible contact I can get to reach her? I really need to see her. It's been a long time since I last saw her. 
But who are you to Hama? I'm her friend, a very good friend. No, don't worry, it's not, it's not a problem. It's no troubles at all. I just need to see her. She's my friend. Please. Can okay. I I'll get her contact? Thank, Thank you. you. That's her number. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Um, okay. I really appreciate this. I'll call her. Let me run along, okay? Thank you. Your name is um Rita. Rita. Okay. All right, nice to meet you, Rita. All right, bye. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Mom, I want to talk to you. What is it? Mom. I introduced Aldugo to you as a lady that I want to marry. A girl after my own heart. Mom, you kicked against it. You brought Sandra and imposed Sandra on me and you said that I must marry her. Aldugo took in. You connived with the doctor and terminated her pregnancy, thereby damaging her womb. Now the Sandra you introduced to me has left this house without you and I knowing her next line of actions. Mom. You did this because of selfish desires. Benson, do you know you are a big fool? You are a fool! When I brought Sandra, why did you not reject her? Eh? You accepted her wholeheartedly. Enjoyed her so well. Now you are blaming me. You are putting the blame on me now. Listen and listen good. Let me not hear you raise this issue in this house again. Else, I will tell you that I'm still your mother. You think I am scared of your threats? Hey, mom, mom, do you think I am scared of your threats? Listen, and listen real good, mom. I swear, if I go down, mom, I promise you, you must go down with me. I see. I can see that you have grown wings. I can see that you have grown wings to talk to me anyhow. But you see those wings of yours? I will break them. I will break them. Let me see how you can fly above the sky. Nonsense. Foolish boy. Animal. Idiot. Nonsense. How are you? Fine, thank you, ma. Ma, there's a lady outside. She said her name is Sandra. Oh, okay. She and wants she... to see me? Yes, ma. Let her in. Okay, ma. any problem I'm afraid there's a problem um, do you by any chance know a certain mr. Benson yes um, Benson from Izuike village you know him That devil is the reason I'm here. Yes. Um, Benson was my husband. I was married to Benson. Yeah, but not anymore. Um, but that's not that's not the message. 
um, while married to Benson, I battled the same thing as you, and that is childlessness. All the years I was married to Benson, I was unable to conceive and have my own child. We did everything medically possible. We went everywhere <laughs> to no avail. In the course of my quest, a friend of mine introduced me to her pastor who had a session of prayer with me. During that session, God revealed to the man of God everything that was wrong and that was where you came into the picture the pastor told me that benson my ex-husband um, got you pregnant way back wanted to marry you but his mother refused and they both connived and had your child aborted even though they lied to you that you had a miscarriage the doctor was in a plan um, your your womb was damaged during this process yeah and that's the reason you're not able to have your own child. Because they damaged your womb, but they never told you. They lied to you. You never had a miscarriage. Yeah. I'm, I'm sorry. Really sorry about that. You, you mean... Benson and his mother did this to me? They did. So, so, what? 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 What do I do now? Um. Well, as for me, I I moved on. I left the marriage. I'm no longer married to him. Like I said earlier, my pastor advised me to quit the marriage. He said there is no possibility that I can have a child with Benson because of the curse that is placed on him. So I, I moved on. So I, just, I just thought you should know about it. I just thought it's important you have the true picture. At least know what is wrong with you. My friend, hold your greetings. No, I had everything. But what? Huh? So all this while, I've been living with my fellow man. I've been living with my fellow man all my efforts. Ah, no problem. No problem. Continue with this, your discussion. I'm, I'm, I'm really sorry, okay? I'm sorry, alright? Let me just be on my way. I'm, I'm sorry about... Please, you, you can't leave me like this. Please sit. Yes, are you, are you sure? Let's, sit. Let's find a solution together, please. I'm, I'm sorry. I know exactly how you feel. I'm, I'm really sorry. Benson. It's wicked. How could they do this to me? How? Are you sure? <laughs> Look, Sandra, 
Before I believe anything you have just told me, okay? I will take my sister to a hospital, a reputable hospital, a specialist. Yes, I'll take her there, they'll run these tests on her and if by any means I find out that really her womb has been tampered with, <laughs> trust me when I say that hospital, I will shut the hospital down. I will shut the hospital down because they will see what they have never ever seen before. I'll be back. We are going, we are, we're going, we're going, okay? I'll be back. God help them. God help them. behind this. No, we're not behind this. It's our ghost. Foolish man. No sense. Please arrest her. Arrest her. Try to make my sister useless. You try to render her useless. This is the end of the world for you. Mm. Officers, please do your job. Please take move. him away from here. Take him away. Let him move. Move now. Uh -uh, move. No slow motion. Please take move. them away. Please. Hurry. Silly things. Try to render my sister useless. Huh? You see, all this your crocodile tears will not have a single effect on me. Right? And don't only come in. You know all this while you know me as a quiet and gentle husband of yours. But listen to me. I'm giving you a few minutes to leave my house because you will not like to see the devil in me. Listen to me. Because there are five no... minutes. It's, it's, it's not even my fault. Five minutes. Oyeka, please. One. Oyeka, please. Two. If you send me out, where do you want me to go to? Oh, yes, Three. Because there are no, no people. Four. Please. Oh, you want to know what I'm doing to you? Please. Oh, yes, yes, please don't do this to me. Oh, yes, it wasn't my fault. Oh, yes, I read everything. Oh, yes, I read everything. Don't do this to me. Oh, yes, please don't do this. Oh, yes, wait. You read her. You read everything. Oh, yes, please. I, I think I'm okay. Oh, yes, please don't do this to me. I cannot live in the So calm down. Relax. Everything will be fine. You're here now. You're with me. Chike. What is a woman's happiness when she cannot bear her own children? What will I be doing in this world if I cannot have my own children? What? <laughs> What did I even do to these people that they decided to render me useless? Ah, no, what? No, don't say that, don't say that. No, 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 I will not take that one. I mean, you're not useless. No, don't say that. Please. Please. <laughs> Listen. 
no matter what it is, I believe there's a solution. <laughs> Even if it means me sending you abroad to find out what is really wrong, I will do it. So just calm down. Relax. Relax. Chicky, I can't, I can't no, relax. No, 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 I can't no, no. You know relax. what? You know what? We're just going to go in and get you something to eat. Okay, we'll go into the kitchen and get you something to eat. Okay? Chicky. Chicky. I've lost appetite. Please. Oh come on! Don't 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 be like this. I mean, this is your house. Okay, that oh. is your kitchen. It's your brother's. House. Come on, let let's let's go eat something. Okay, please. <laughs> I need children. I don't need food. I don't need food, chicken. I don't need food. I need my own children. Ada, it's okay. You will have your own children. Just calm down. <laughs> Relax. Come on. <laughs> Can't it wait till tomorrow? No, 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 please stand up. It's, it's important. Let's talk now. Honey, sit up ah. now. Sit up. Let's talk. I don't want to shout. It's late. Honey! It's okay. Sit up, please. It's very important. When is your sister leaving the house? What did you say? You heard me loud and clear. I said, when is your sister leaving the house? She has overstayed her welcome. She should go. Are you okay? Are you alright? Excuse me. Are you okay? Are you alright? I'm fine. You're Nothing not. is wrong with you. You are not. You're obviously not. That is my sister. And so? My only sister. And so? Will you shut up? What are you talking about? My sister will stay here till she deems fit to leave. Yes. That is what I've said. And that is what it's going to be. That's how it's going to be. Do you realize that, that my sister is the foundation of the money I used to build this house? Of my world? The same house you're in and you're ranting this nonsense? Are you done blabbing? No, Chike, tell me. Are you done ranting? Listen to me, Mr. Man. I don't care if she's the plaster, the foundation, or the cement, or you used to build this house. I don't care. All I know is that she's overstayed her welcome and she should go. Is she not married? Oh, no, Behodi. Let her go back to her husband or go to the village. I don't care. What nonsense. She has stayed weeks in this house. Before you know it now, she will start dragging bed with me. All in the name of your sister, your sister, your sister. What kind of sister is that one? Let her go back to her husband. Let her go back to her husband's house. She's married. I can't be dragging my house with her. She's obviously enjoying herself in my visitor's room. And Very soon she will still mad. come here. You're obviously mad. You are mad. I'm not mad though. Chike, I'm not mad. I don't understand. She has stayed weeks in this house. Am I not sharing my husband's house with her? Can you imagine? Better do something about it. Can you it. just stop making noise or do you want me to leave this room for you? Go and tell her 
want to pack her things and leave tomorrow morning if possible. What nonsense. Tell her to go. What nonsense. Where are you going? Okay, thank you so much. Please help me pass my message to her. Tell her to go. She has not said I will come. What rubbish? Sister, my sister, my sister, my sister. Can you imagine? For how many weeks now? Please, oh, let's say they start. Before now, they're going to begin to drag bed with me. Nonsense. I don't understand. Sorry, what nonsense are you talking about? You heard me loud and clear. Who gave you access to my kitchen? Adugo. I'm asking you, who gave you access to my kitchen? But, uh, oh, I see you've grown wings. Okay. You had the guts to go to my kitchen and dish this large quantity of food with this big chicken. Ah, Jesus. You get mine though. Tessie. No, you get mind. Tessie. Starting when? No, wait, wait. Are you really talking to me like that? No, I'm talking to your spirit. I'm talking to your spirit. What nonsense. In fact, let me take the food so you know that I'm talking to you. I'm talking to you, madam. Listen to me. I will not Drag my kitchen with you. If you know what is good for you, pack your things and go back to your husband's house. Go back to your husband's house and leave my husband's house for me. What nonsense! I will not entertain this rubbish. I will not. Go to your husband's house. Before you come back here again, we will invite you. Do not come and invite her though. Don't try it. Rubbish. Can you imagine? You two, you even balanced. For your mind, you have arrived. I don't blame you. Don't try this rubbish again. No, don't try it again. Go to your husband's house. How is it for better for worse? Sometimes it's sweet, sometimes it's, it's bitter. Endure! Nonsense. Better go to your husband's house, oh. Go to your husband's house. Can you imagine? What nonsense? Adugo. What is really happening to me? Did Tessie really talk to me like that? No. Am I dreaming? She even took the food I was eating. No. This is not normal. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. This is not normal. Something is wrong somewhere. Hugo, what is really happening to you? What is happening to you? Tessie, are you mad? No, no, Tessie, I, I, are you okay? I, are you sick? Is something wrong with you? When did it start? Why would you insult my sister? No, what effrontery do you have? What authority do you have to tell my sister to live here? For what reason? Now, the food you're talking about, okay? Are you the one who provided money to buy that food? Are you the one? Huh? And what's all this, all this chewing of gum like, 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 like an idiot? It must stop, else you get another thing coming. Are you done drowning? No, tell me, are you done? I have said my mind. Tell your sister to pack her things and leave this house. She has overstayed her welcome. I will not say this again. I'm very, very serious about it. The food you're talking about belongs to you and I. The money, everything, because I am your wife. So if you know what is good for you, tell her to get out. Let her go back to her husband's house. On Udi, she's married. What nonsense. Or do you want me to pack my things and leave? 
You heard me. I will pack my things and leave this house for you. And I will leave my son behind. Do not say I do not want you. Tell her to leave. Tell her to leave. But better get out of this house, oh, madam. Now listen here, okay? You saying you're going to leave. You will leave here. And not only leave, you leave my son. I know you're a joker and you better stop that nonsense. You leave here and leave my son. Now trust me when I say this, alright? If you try that with me, trust me again when I say another woman will come into this house and there will be no space for you to come in here. Open. I don't give a dime. Tell your sister to leave my husband's house. Do you understand? If you want, pack 20 women or 100 women, or come here. It doesn't concern me. I am your first wife and I will remain your first and last. Nobody will come here and take my boss, not even your sister. Pointing at my sister. I'm pointing at her. Stop pointing. What will you sister. do? What Stop will you do? My what will you do? Are you happy now? Small witch, are you happy now? Are you happy that you're talking between my husband and I? Are you happy? Leave my husband's house. You are happy now yes. I'm having issue with my husband, Abby. You are happy. Leave my husband's yes. house. Stop pointing if you know what is good for you, tell her to take her filthy self and leave this house. I will not warn you again. Rubbish. Tessie, come back here. Bone breaker, you want to come and scatter my house. Tessie, phone. come back here. Tessie, I said come back here. Rubbish. Tessie. is really happening to me? Why is my brother's wife talking to me like this? What, what should I do? Oh God. God, please help me. I am confused. Father, I just look up to you. Just... Help me. Help me. What's all this? Huh? What's the meaning of this? What do you what do you mean I should do my sister? Come on, baby, stop this now. Stop behaving this way. Now. I'm not I'm not I'm not playing now. with you. I'm not playing with you. Don't tamper with this boundary. Don't cross this boundary at all. What is your problem? Did I not warn you? You should tell your sister to leave the house, but you refused. Now you want to do. Come and do now. You are not doing this night, so in fact you will not touch me until your sister leaves this house. Who's this now? Let her go! What you want me? For my entitlement, what's all this? Which entitlement? Which entitlement? Entitlement that you don't respect? Do you respect me at all? If you respect me, you will, you, you will listen to me. But you refuse. Don't disturb my life, oh. Please. Besides, I don't want you to disturb her with your loud noise. Have you forgotten how it used to be? What do you mean? Do you make love like, 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 like we are one uh, uh, life band? What's, uh, what's all this now? Look at this one, oh. Have you forgotten? Have you forgotten that it used to be louder than a life band? Have you forgotten how you used to shout and mourn as if you want to die? Stop this. Eh? Stop Don't touch this happen now. What's all this? Don't now? touch me. I'm not playing with you. Till your sister leaves this house, you will not see anything. You will not even smell it. Nothing for you. Get her closed. This promised land, you will not enter. You will be seeing it, but you will not enter. Tell her to leave. You heard me. Tell her to leave. Yes, let her leave. She has overstayed her welcome. Before I make love to my wife. Yes, I will not do until your sister leaves this house. And that's on period. I said so. 
Don't cross this boundary. Or don't even try it. Shift. Respect yourself, Mr. Man. Shift. It is. We can always talk about it. Talk about what? Talk about what exactly? Madam, you have overstayed your welcome. Are you not ashamed of yourself? You were in your brother's house. Do you what? Only nobody? Are you not married? Go to your husband's house. Simple. Leave my husband for me. What kind of nonsense is that? Now I said that I'll do And now I said that I'll do I'm everywhere. Please, oh, leave in peace. Biko, before Barbie sees. What nonsense? H hello, H hello, Chike. Where are you? Okay. Okay. Chicken, please, please, just come back to the house now. I, I don't know what came over your your wife. She's throwing my things out of the house. Is that right? Yes. Please. Okay. Thank you. Are you done? Okay, you have called police for me. Are you done? I'm waiting. Don't worry. Let him come back. You're not ashamed of yourself. What are you doing in your brother's house? Baby girl, Basigi. Baby girl, Basigi. Go to your husband. You are married. So what is pursuing you? Get in that Go to your husband's house. No marriage is perfect. Go back there. One has to go to the car. No, the there. One has to go back there. No, the there. One has to go there. Stay there and endure. No marriage is perfect. Yes. Go back to your husband. I don't want to see your legs again. I'm not playing with you. I'm not playing with you. Hey, you will see fire. Yes. Sensi, please. I said so. Don't do this. No don't sense. do this. Whatever it is, we can we can always talk about it. Don't okay, now. Go pass. Let me see you now. Go pass. Let me see you. Go and pass now. Pass, let me see you. You better let come, come on, get out. Let me not see you in this house again. No sense. You are calling for me. No, Tessie, Tessie, wait come now. Tessie, we can't discuss it. No sense. What has come over her now? What is, what is... Why are your things outside? It's your wife. I, I don't even know what came over her. She did what? See now, everything is outside. Hey! Hello? Hello? Taxi! Uh -huh. uh -huh. What, what is, is going on? What's going on here? What is happening here? Why are my sister's things out here. Why are her bags here? What is really happening? Policeman, are you back? I don't understand what you're saying. Why are her bags here? What did you see? What does it look like? I brought her things out now. For what? She has overstayed her welcome. Very simple. Let her go back to the village or go to her husband's house. What do you mean by that? I mean, what, what, what do you mean by she should go back to the I mean, what, what, where, where do you want her to go? Really? To the village or to her husband's house. Simple. Tessie, what is wrong with you? Nothing. No, Tessie, what is I mean, what has this my sister done to you to, to, to make you hate her this much? What is really happening? What has she done to you? Hey, God. God. I'm not in a example, so I can't answer all these questions. What has Zoban Kiobula done? What has Zoban Kiobula done? What is all this nonsense? Tell us to go back to her husband's house or go back to the village. Simple. I am in my husband's house. What is she doing here? Every morning, now I sit down for a dugo. Now you're about for a dugo. Now you're about. I look at, look at she everywhere. Look at she everywhere. I think, I think, I think, I think she's, she's my co-wife. What nonsense! Let her get out. What is Madam, wrong? you've overstayed your welcome. So pack your things and go. You're not my co-wife. What, what nonsense? Wrong? What's wrong with you? What is wrong with you? What? 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 what, what Everything wrong? is wrong with me. Everything is wrong with me. She has overstayed her welcome. So let her go. Let her go. I want to enjoy my house. Enjoy my home. Open every time you nice I 
you to start being a dagger's drawn or you know getting any physical bout. No. Um I don't want to leave him and leaving my son here with me. How will I manage? You know, how will I manage my son and business together? So please uh you will go to the village. Yes, you will go to the village and then um I will you know I'll make sure you're well taken care of. You know, I'll, 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 yes. Are you really the one saying this to me? No no can can somebody just wake me up from this dream? You are not dreaming, madam. See, let me just go to the Chicken, video. you. Let me drop you off. Let's not talk about this. After let me drop, let me, everything I've done let for me you. Drop, no, let Chicken. Let me just go drop you off. Please, please, please. Drop, everything. Drop you, off. drop you off. What kind of nonsense talk is that? Madam, try to the village. Oh, go and take that Take that ball. Take that back. Just go. You are not using our car. Go. Go. If you don't want to. Besides, you need exercise. So, drink. What kind of thought is that? Okay, come and eat your lunch. Your lunch is ready. Chicken. Everything I am going through today is because I gave you my opportunity as my brother. And so what? And so what? And so what? Every minute opportunity. I gave you opportunity. I gave... Let us all die now because you gave me opportunity. Are you the only person to sacrifice an opportunity? Let us all die now. Every minute I gave you opportunity. The money I'm doing today, I gave you opportunity. If you are God, all of us will die now. Madam, go back because same opportunity. Then we doing that one. Opportunity, every minute, opportunity, opportunity. Eh, we should all die now because you gave me opportunity. Nonsense. Rubbish. I need to you in opportunity. Leave my... What are you going to see here? Come on, let's go. Leave this house. Leave my house. Leave. I want to see. I'll push you. Don't, don't touch me. I'll, I'll go. You. I'll what's go. Let her go now. Let her go. What's this now? What's, what's, what's this? I, I, I gave you opportunity. I'm so what? What's wrong with you now? I'm so what? What kind of What's this now? Emotional blackmail is that one. What's this? What is wrong? What do you want to do again? Let her go. She's already going now. Uh, let what's her, this now? She's already go. going. Uh, let her go. Opportunity, opportunity. I gave you opportunity. I gave you opportunity. Hey, can I can't move that. Let us all die because you gave him opportunity. Nonsense. Chica, <laughs> get out too. Mm. Chica, you mad? What is your problem? Huh? Why must you ask a dog out of your house? Huh? Why must you just out of your house? The only sister you have. Eh? The only sister you have, you just her out of your house. Do you want her to die? Oh, what are we talking about here? No, seriously, what are we talking about? Do you realize my wife said she will leave me? Leave our home. Leave our son. Leave the marriage. If Adugo continues to stay in the house. No, no, no. What do I do? You know, she will leave, uncle. Seriously, she will leave my son with me. And now, how do I manage it? How do I manage my business and taking care of my son, and me taking care of my son in the house? How do I do that? Do you know you're mad? You are stupid. You mad, Papa? My wife. Do you know that if your wife had left the house, Adugo would have taken care of uh, your son very well. Don't, 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 don't. 
people stop this please I mean, look this is not what you should be talking about okay i need you to talk to adogo you know let her come back to her senses let, let her just you know hear me out so give me audience when i call her let her listen when i buy things for her let, let her take instead of uh, ranting I, I mean this is what we should do you don't know, talk to her you know let her be put back in check you know let her listen to me take things i give her i, I promise i'll take care of her it's not about ranting uncle me ranting your uncle ranting i'm, I'm very sorry sir i'm very sorry i'm very sorry let me tell you, do you know that if you are in Adugo shoe, you wouldn't have done what, uh, 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 more than what she's doing? What Adugo needs now is not all these things, we are buying this, we are buying that one. She needs somebody that will console her, somebody that will be talking to her to stop thinking. Somebody that... Well, Jake, what is your problem? Eh? See, if not that uh, 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 my daughter uh, uh, do go there to console her, she would have uh, 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 committed suicide by now. And you're here talking, my wife said this, my wife said that. Please, please, please. That girl is in pain. She's in pain. Uncle, please. I mean, you're our uncle. I mean, you should use your grace, poise, and aura to talk to her now. Talk to her. I mean, let her forgive me. Let, then, then let us, you know, let us talk. Let, I mean, I've already said I will, I, will, I will take care of her. Let her just, you know, take things I buy for her. Let her just give me audience. You know, coming to my house right now is not an option. The heat is much. I should talk to Adugo. Yes. I should talk to Adugo. Yes, sir. After all you do to her, I should talk to her. Stop. It's all right. No problem. I will talk to her. Thanks. But I want you to know that Adugo is in pain. Adugo is in serious pain because of what you did to her. She's in pain. Think twice, Chike. Think twice. Hey. Hi, Oni. Hi, hi, darling. Are you, to go? Yeah. Right. you two are still here. Yeah. Why are you not in school by now, young man? <laughs> He's still eating. You know the struggle. Don't worry, we'll still be living. Yeah, that's my boy. Uh, honey, I know you'll be wondering why I'm going out this early, but actually, yeah. uh, uh, I have my three containers. Uh, come in very early this morning so okay. i have to be there to watch them offload it okay and do some bank transactions as well that's good news yes 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 i yes, wish yes. you all the best always my love always, <laughs> mm, always, always, always. thank you all okay. right man big man big man give me that give me that come give on now. give me come on come on good boy <laughs> okay give me five give me that give me okay all right all right, all honey. right, honey. Mm, mm, right. Okay. Yeah, all right okay Eat. Eat, boy. It's in the fast, alright? Eat, eat, eat. That's the boy. Eat, 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 eat. Hmm. Babe, this orange tastes really good. It does? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Do you want to have some? No, no, no. I'm fine. I'm good. I'm good. Alright. Once I'm done with this, I'm going to have a taste of those wines in the fridge. Oh. I mean the one you brought home. Oh, the wine. Okay. Ah, uh, trust me. You see, um, <coughs> the white one and the red one, yeah? You see that white one is number one in Spain right now. Yes. Really? And yeah, yeah, yeah. The red one is so much in demand. I mean, the orders I have for it are <laughs> great. I'm wow. making a killing with regards to money when I sell those wines. <laughs> wow. Yes. And you imported one full container of it, right? Matter of fact, two. Really? Yes. Two containers? Two. <laughs> My goodness, babe. Yes. God is really on our side. I can say that again. You can say that again. Two containers? Of course, of course. That's huge. Very huge. <laughs> All right, okay, okay, right now. Yeah. When are you getting me the car you promised me? Honey, come on. Honey, you know I don't go back on my promises, so here's what's up. As soon as I'm done dusted, I've sold off everything in my three containers by next week. You have in your car. Brandy. Yay, oh my goodness. Thank you so much. You're welcome, baby. Thank you. Babe, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. You know I love you. 
You know I love you. Baby. And I love you too. I love you, mega, mega, I love you now and forever. Yes, I'm so happy. <laughs> Why Very is soon this guy you calling come. me at this time? Hey. Why New would you be calling me now? This is wicked. What's your problem? New car loaded. Oh my god. What? What? No, no. What, what, what would you say? Huh? How? What, what, what do you mean? How? How? The whole world, the whole warehouse burning Jesus. right now. Babe. Oh my God, my God, Babe, what, my God, what's going on? Babe, where's the car key? Where's the car key? Babe, babe, what's going on? Babe, babe. Three containers? Three containers? In my warehouse, all gone. I mean, how? How? Three containers? How do I go about this now? Huh? How? I'm, I'm, I'm finished. I'm, I'm done for. Three containers. Three. Three. Go gone. Uh, Birds to ash in the warehouse. Everything gone. Close the other goods in the warehouse. I mean, who told, who told, who told, oh my god, who told them to, who told them not to put off the lights and the gate they put on the heater there, a heater, who will be pushing the boiling ring there, for what reason? Can you just calm down? Calm down. Do I got this? Where do I start from? Where do I, right now I'm even in debt. I took some of great. Uh, where, where, where will I start from? Where? 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 Who in God's name told that person? Who in God's name uses a boiler in a warehouse? Put yourself together. I mean, how do I start? Shit happens. Chicken! Chicken! Are you going out? Yes. I see. What about the money I requested for my toiletries? Give it to me now. Um, you mean the... Uh, the 25,000 naira I requested! Nyemiya, give it to me now! There's no need getting aggressive, okay? Um, I, I, I told you things are bad right now. I, 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 I don't have... You... <sighs> Look. You what? You don't have what? Ordinary 25,000 naira you don't have! Okay. You don't... Give me the money, please! I don't want to hear this nonsense say Give me money! Calm down, calm down. I'll see what I can do. Calm I'll see, down. so be fast about it. I don't have money. Ah. Please, oh. I have to uh, have this. So, um, have that. What is this? That's what I can afford, bro. God forbid, bad thing. I told you, you have you, to manage. Come really? On. You're giving me 2,000 naira for my toiletries? That's what I have. Can this buy my soap? Can this buy my cream? Come on, please. Come on, manage that. Manage thing. what? Chicken, I hate to hear that word manage in my life. I hate to manage. I've been a waffle, chicken. I've been a waffle. What is manage? If you know what is good for you, provide me with the money I requested for. Not this nonsense! Rubbish! Please excuse me. I don't want to wait for you, oh. Please!
chicken, where is your car? Um, I sold it. <gasps> you did what? I sold it. You know, for the past uh, five months, you know, one has been struggling. Uh, I mean, things have been very bad, so I've had no other option but to sell the car to add the money to the little business I have now to see if, you know, one can bounce back and stand again. Yeah, that's it. Hey! Hey! God, this is not what I planned for myself. God. Chike, you did what? Chike, what is wrong with you? First of all, you told me the person you were owing took your first car. Now you've sold the second one. I hope you're not planning to drag my own with me. Chike, avoid my car. If you know what is, avoid my car if you know what is good for you. Avoid it all. Please. What kind of nonsense is this now? What is all this nonsense? Relax. 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 Why will I relax? relax? It's your car, okay? We'll manage. It's your car. Your car is your I car. I don't we'll want to manage. I've told you. I hate that word, manage. I don't want it. Please. I hate to manage. I don't know what I don't know what I because I did not come this life to suffer. What's all this nonsense? You two cars are gone. Just like that. Like they let me now. One day I'll wake up one morning. This house, you will sell it and tell me, let's manage. Uh, let's go to the village and start small business. From there, we'll bounce back. I don't want to hear that though. I don't want to hear that one. Oh, please oh, please oh, avoid my car. If you don't avoid my car, oh, avoid it. If you want to trek, trek. Since you like supper, I like rafu. I like rafu. We go avoid it. What nonsense? Eh? See the trouble? Let me even go and hide my car papers. Somebody will pull the car. GT! 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 Madam! Madam! Where is my car that I asked you to wash for me? Okay, madam. As I did wash I'm going to drive the motor come out. Oh, my goodness. As I did wash I'm going to drive the motor come out. And you allowed him. I don't understand. So how am I supposed to take my son to the lesson center? Make a rush go road, go find Keke or mini boss go carry Junior. You must be very stupid. Sorry, ma. Will you get out of my sight? Get out! Sorry, ma. It's yours. Okay, you let this thing. Way. I gave you my key to wash my car for me and you gave it to him just like that. You're suggesting Keke for me. I don't blame you. God. I don't blame you. When you eat free food in this house, what else do you, what else do you now to do? Let's go with taxi. When I have a car, God forbid, I reject it in Jesus' name. God forbid, party. Listen, Junior, there's no lesson for you today. So let's just go back inside. Tomorrow, you want to go? But I want him. I want him, oh. I want him. Hey, hey, hey. Okay, ready for today. You just say, come on. You come back and meet me here. Okay. Jesse, I'm talking to you. <clears throat> you know, I'll ignore your ill manners and tell you this. I went to work today to cater for my family. 
to keep my family in a good positive bond. Only for me to come back this evening. Went to my son's room and he said he didn't go to lesson. So my question to you is why? Why didn't my son go to the lesson center? Why? I'm talking to you. Are you really asking me that? Yes, I'm asking you that question. For real? Yes, for real. All right. Chike, how do you expect me to take Gino to the lesson center? Eh? Am I a witch? Should I fly him to the lesson center? Chike, you drove away with my car and you expect me to take Gino to the lesson center? How? With a taxi. With a bus. With Keke. Yes, yes, you have to. Don't, don't say you reject it, okay? Don't say that. There are other parents who do not have cars, but their children still go to school, they still go to lesson. There are parents also who used to have cars, but today they don't have no car, but then their children still go to school and still go to lessons. So how come yours is different? What is wrong with you? I've told you, let us manage. Let's manage. Things are bad. I reject it in Jesus' name. I reject it, Chike. I refuse to manage. I've told you before, and I'm saying it again. I hate that word, manage. I hate to manage, Chike. I hate to manage. Manage what? I've told you before, and I'm saying it again. I hate that word, manage. I hate it. I hate to manage. Yes, I hate it. What rubbish. Chike, when you met me, before you got married to me, was I like this? Answer me, was I like this? Now, Chike, look at me. Look at what you've turned me into. I should manage. I will not manage. Chica, before you got married to me, I used to be bougie, classy, smart and intelligent. But now, look at me. Look at me, Chike. I now look like an old woman. Old haggard woman. All because of you. What rubbish. Can you imagine? Now, listen to me, young man. I got married to you because of what you had. Now that those things have vanished, I think I will do myself a favor and vanish as well. Yes, I have to vanish. I don't want to die young. I don't want to die young. So, I will do myself a favor and go back to UK where I was before I got married to you. What rubbish! You cannot come into a house girl. Oh, you never manage, manage, manage. I cannot manage. I have to manage. What rubbish! Manage what? Are you serious? Manage me. Me, sexy. I should manage. I should, I should go and jump into taxi. Because I want to take my son to the little center. Never! I reject in Jesus' name. Don't touch my car again. What am I even talking about? I'm leaving you soon. Hey, sir! I can't manage. This is not what I bargained for. I can't manage. Like, like. It's not possible. I don't come this life, come suffer. I know they live like that. I don't come suffer for this life at all. I go and enjoy myself. Please. Ah, I cannot go from here to here. Never. I can't manage. Go back to the UK, Isa. Sir, Oga, welcome, sir. Yes, how are you? Oga, I find small. What do you mean by your fine small? Oga, big thing happened for this house to do. Look, I've had a long day, okay? Can you just tell me what is going on, please? Oga, mm. I swear to God, wait with me and you. I know they play with you this afternoon. Oga, madam, come here with big mood to come pack all our things, go. Say she know they marry again. Excuse me? What, what, are you, what are you talking about? I didn't tell you to. Madam, come back at him. Say she don't go abroad. Ma, I tell you, say she know they marry again. No. Are you serious? Huh? We got one joke with you. And, and, and what of my son? My son? My, my, my son? Huh? Your son, Junior, like that inside Palo. Madam, she never qualified to go abroad. Junior is in the Palo? Mm hmm, they're down for Palo. We got sorry. That's sorry. Sorry, sir. 
Oh, that's sorry, huh? Sorry, sir. Child, oh, that's sorry. Huh? Women. And this thing, I said, no, go marry for this life. Find man like this. We go create, give pink leaves, set. Now woman will come to do like this. Come on in no day. Tell me talk to Adugo. Tell her to please, please, uh, let, let her follow me back to, to the city. Let her follow me back to my house. Let her come live with me because I've been struggling since my wife left. You know, I, I, I need her to come take care of my son. You know, since this unfortunate incident, uh, you know, of, of my warehouse burning with my goods, I've been struggling. I need somebody to take care of my son so that I can concentrate on this, my business, to see if I will stand up again. Please, don't tell me talk to her. Chike. Sir. You want me to help you talk to Adugo? Of course, sir. Chike, before now, I warned you, but you wouldn't listen. Now, something is happening. You just Adugo, the only sister you have, you just her out of your house because of your wife. Now, that same wife of yours has left you. And you want to go back to that same adugo you push out of your house. Okay? Uh, Chike, let me, let me remind you, in case if you have forgotten. Some time ago, you promised adugo that you would take her to India for medical checkup because of her condition. Did you do it? The answer is no. Some time ago again, adugo begged you, cried for you. To adopt a child, for just a child, a child that she would train as and call her her own child. Chike, did you do it? The answer is no. None. You want me to go and talk to her? Okay? You want me to go and talk to Adugo? Now tell me, what will I tell Adugo if I go to her? Tell me, what will I tell Adugo? What do you want me to tell Adugo? Chike, please. You go quite long. Go to Adugo. Talk to Adugo. Sort yourself out with her. Go, please. Go, please, please. Please, I beg you. I mean, look, you, I, I, you and I know the answer she will give me. She will say no again, but, but I just need you to talk to her. She will refuse. Uh, yes. Okay. You want me to go and talk to her? Yes, sir. It's all right. I will go and talk to Adugo. Thank you, sir. Thank you, I will sir. talk to her. Thank when you, I see her, I will tell her to take her that she take things easy. That you, her brother is an evil man. Leave my house. Sir. Uncle. I said I will talk to Adugo. I will tell her that her brother Chike is an evil man. Chike, go now. Leave my house. Chike, go now. Leave my house. Get out. You want me to go and talk to Adugo? Because your so-called wife has left you. Now you remember that you have a sister. If you are there, make it. I will talk to you. I will talk to you. Hello, ma'am. <laughs> ah, I do 
ago you have suffered. Ah! Suddenly, Chike, your brother, now remembers he has a sister. <laughs> Because your wife left you and your child. You had the nerves. You, you, you actually had the effrontery to come here to come and plead with me to go back with you to the city to take care of you and your child. Hey, Chike. Chike. What, what do you really take me for? Anyway, I, I don't blame you. I don't blame you. All this is happening because I don't have a child of my own, of which you are the cause. Chike, what have I done to you? What have I done to you? Why is it that any time I try to move on with my life, you, you just pop up to remind me about all the things you have done to me? What have I done to you? Eh? Sister, please now. Please. Don't 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 take it the way you're taking it, okay? You don't have to take it this way. Chiki, how, how should I take it? Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I should have actually clapped for you when you came. <laughs> Chike, you don't have a heart. Because if you do. You will not walk in here to tell me this rubbish you're saying. No problem. As a sister, I will advise you. Go and look for your wife. Let her come and take care of you and your child. Or, you can get a nanny. Or, a house help. But please, Chike, please, just leave me alone. Just leave me alone, Biko. Okay, Mr. Keke Driver, I'm sorry, what's that your name again? Vincent, good, okay, Vincent, okay? You bring your keke here every day except Saturdays and Sundays. 6.30 to be precise. Every day except Saturdays and Sundays to take my son to school at 6.30 sharp. You must be here. Alright? I'll give you the money we've agreed. If you do a good job, you know, I'll give you a bigger tip. Alright? It's okay, sir. I will give you all the services you want. Very well. I can even be here tomorrow by 6 a.m. in the morning. <laughs> because I don't joke with time and I don't uh, play with my joke. No, no, no. 6.30 will be fine. 6.30. Okay? So, my boy, Uncle Vincent will be taking you to school. Okay? Okay. Alright? Alright. Good. Okay, sir. Okay. All right. Okay. Bye -bye. Say bye to Uncle Vincent. Bye. <laughs> so, <clears throat> do you want anything? Hmm? What? that you hired a keke driver to take your son to school? I mean, how is that even possible, Chike? Listen to yourself! Okay, hold on, hold on. A keke driver you don't even know. Do you know where he lives? Do you know, do you, do you know any of his relatives? Oh, of course you don't know any. Chike, you are about to make a grave mistake again. I should calm down. 
calm down for what? Listen, if this boy gets missing, where will you locate this KK driver? You don't know his house, you don't know where he lives, you don't know his relatives. Nothing. Oh boy, something they worry you. Think about this matter carefully. Stop it already! Don't do that! Chike, please don't do that. You will make a very big mistake if you do that. Imagine. Sandra, you are pregnant. <laughs> How did it happen? I do go. What is the magic? I am pregnant, so. <laughs> See. All I can say is that this is the handwork of God. It is so obvious. Mm -hmm. See, I don't even know what to say, but I know that God at some point remembered me and decided to compensate me. Uh -huh. You remember after the last time we saw in the city? Mm -hmm. Of course, I left my marriage. Mm -hmm. I got married again and barely how many months into my new marriage this is it <laughs> right now i feel like the whole world is on my shoulders i am so happy god decided to compensate me for the years i wasted with that cost family benson and his mother i thank god sandra mm -hmm. just like that just like that <laughs> Amazing how God I am I'm telling you, I am so happy for you. I know. Congratulations. So. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Sandra. Congrats. It's okay. Thank you. Just look at the kind of condition that evil family puts me into. Just just look at me now. Just lying faced away in the village. Just like a useless sharp. What what am I going to do with myself? What? Adugo. Adugo, listen. This is not the end of the world. Oh, it is. It is. Can't you see? No, it is not. Don't give up on God. I know that God has a plan for you, okay? And in due time, his plans for you are going to be unveiled. Sandra. Adugo, listen. I came to see you for a reason. Chair off. Um, there's this uncle of mine in the city. He's very rich. I mean very rich. He unfortunately lost his wife about a year and two months ago. His wife left him with three adorable children. They're still very tender. Right now he's planning to remarry. He needs a woman who's humble, God-fearing, a woman that has a good heart. You know, you know how this stepmother thing works. Um, so, he just needs a woman that can, you know, come into his home, hold it together, and take care of his children. And I, I recommended you. Yeah, I mean, I, I know you have a good heart. You have an amazing soul. So, uh, right now, he just asked me to talk to you about it and see what you think. Sandra. Thank you so much for the recommendation. But, you know, it's not possible. I mean, who is going to get married to me knowing full well that I don't have a womb? Who? Marrying me is just going to be like having a man in the house. So it's not, it's not possible. Um, I do go. All that is not a problem. Okay? It isn't a problem at all. Because I told him everything about you. He is aware. He knows about your condition. But the good news is, 
He is not looking for a woman for procreation. He's not looking for a woman to bear children for him. Remember I told you he has three adorable children. They're still very young. All he needs is a mother figure. A woman these children can look up to and call mommy. A woman that can take care of these children as her own. You know how this stepmother thing works. He just needs a good woman. And I know that deep down, you are a good woman. You have a good heart. You have an amazing spirit. I know you can do this. I know these children will love you and you're going to love them. But come to think of it, this might just be a way of God compensating you. I mean, look at the brighter picture. You are going to have three adorable children. Children you can call your own proudly. What do you say? Sandra. Yes. Are you really sure about this? Why not? I'm sure. It's all about you now. It's your willingness to do this, to take up this responsibility of motherhood. <laughs> if you're really sure, tell him to come and see me. Right? I'm sure. And yes, he'll come and see you from tomorrow. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> you're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> Adugo, Sandra told me everything about you. She told me how good you are. And I promise you, if you marry me, you will never have to cry again. One of the most important things I need from you is to be a mother to my children. Accept them as your own children. For they will accept you as their own mother. And I promise you, you will never regret this. Um, I will discuss with my uncle and gets back to you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Adugo. Thank you. I promise you, you will never regret this. Today is your day. <laughs> it's yours. <laughs> you can have it. <laughs> it's yours. My beautiful wife, Adugo. The first time I visited your house, I said something that day. And that's what I want to fulfill. <laughs> I said, I'm going to make you very happy if you marry me. And I meant it. Look at the way you have been taking care of my kids, just like your mother. They are so fond of you, so happy and comfortable whenever they are with you. <laughs> and I say thank you. Thank you again. But not just thank you. Not just like the way teachers get their reward in heaven, but your reward is here. Go ahead. Enjoy. It's yours. 
<laughs> Go on. <laughs> you put you 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 put the coffee. Yes. It's yours. I, I, I do go. <laughs> ben, Ben. It's okay. yours. More. What would I have done without you? You came into my life at the point where I had lost all hope. You came and became sunshine in my life. Thank you. Don't mention me. I, I just love the way you love me. Thank you so much. Thank you. Come here. <laughs> Chinke, what are you doing in my house? <clears throat> By the way, who are these people? Um, good afternoon again, sir. Uh, this is Paul. Of course, you know Paul. Paul has been my friend uh, for a long time. Uh, he came here to give me moral support, as usual. And uh, this is uh, <clears throat> uh, his auntie. Our auntie Anita, yes, um, and, and my uncle, and uh, you know, uh, the thing is, um, we are here because, uh, you know, after the last time you talked to me, I had to do some deep thinking, uh, realizing I have done so much wrong to my sister, so I needed to fill in the blanks and do the needful. Um, so I took the plunge through Auntie Anita here uh, to uh, adopt this uh, lovely baby for Adugo so that uh, Adugo can train her and in turn uh, she will take care of Adugo when uh, Adugo is old. <laughs> Chike, yes, sir. you mean you adopted the child for Adugo? Yes, sir. This baby? Yes, sir. <laughs> Chefo, Chike, Chefo, get a catch you for Huh? Call on with Gaka. Clap for yourself. Yeah, in there. Let me ask you. He said your name is uh, Aneta. Aneta? Yes, sir. Good. I see you as a person, as a good person. Huh? Yes, sir. Who are you? Are you Chike's concubine? Ah, no, sir. Sir, please, everything he told you is the truth. Ah. Yes, sir. All right. All the man. Uh, Chike, sir. for your information, Adugo, your sister, is now married. And she's living in the city with her husband. Huh? Eh. How, 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 when, when did she get married? When did she get married? How? When? When? What, what are we talking about here? I mean, how? How come nobody told me? Besides, uh, besides, how can she get married? How? No, what, what, what? No, oh, come on now. This is um, why would she get married when she knows she can't have a child? My friend, shut up. No, what, what would the, what, what will happen if the man knows that she can't conceive? Will you shut up? Make sure. How do you mean how how will she get married when, when she knows that she cannot confuse co co conceive? What must she tell you? You never have someone confused and conceive. Anyway, um, I'm going for a meeting. Where you people are done, say you know your way out. Yeah, um. Ulita. Uncle, please, please. At least, can, can you just tell me, you know, where, 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 where she is, how, how I can reach her? Because I, I need to talk to her. This is, this is her baby. I should tell you where she is. Yes. I will not. In fact, I don't know. And even if I know, I will not tell you. Hi. You can go ask Ulita. Ulita will let Ulita tell you. Sir, please. Please help him. Help him. Just give him the address, sir. Please. She needs a, he needs a help. Yes. And you want me to help him. Yes, sir. Don't worry. I will help him. I think your parents are still alive. 
Ah, ça, Nina, il y a plein de la life. Ça? Moi, il y a plein de la life. Well, ça, my mother is still alive. Your mother? Okay, at least uh, among your two parents, uh, your father and mother, your mother is alive. Beautiful. I will help him. Hmm? I will help him. I will tell my king's man to bring him to your hands to come and pay your blood price. I think that is a way of helping him. And if his wife is late, you can be his wife. So that's the only help I can render to you now. Be his wife. Simple. No, sir, please. Oh, sister, you're looking good. Thank you. Ada? Yeah. Chike? I do go. What are you doing here? And who is she? Mm, you look good. Thank you. Your, your house is nice. Thank you. Mommy will be inside. Oh, right. please carry it with your mom. I'll see you guys shortly, all right? <laughs> Aha. Um, I don't understand. They called you mommy. Oh, because they are my children. Your children? Yes. Stop, stop. Stop. You see, I... You see, I, I know I have wronged you. And, you know, like I've been telling you, I'm sorry. I am so sorry. Uh, um, please, please forgive me. Please. Um, and, and for the reason I have wronged you, I have decided to do the right thing. You know? I've decided to do the right thing by, by uh, asking them to go help me adopt this child for you. Yes. Uh, th this is a child I've adopted for you, uh, for for you to take care of, and for the child to take care of you too, when you're old. Yes, because you know you just have to. This marriage won't last. I'm sorry. Yes, uh, I mean you can't conceive. You and I know that. So I don't want this man kicking you out, uh, and and then you go back to point zero. You understand me? I mean. These are not your biological children, so please, just just come to my house and let's take care of, of, of this child and, and, and my son together, you know? Okay. Yes. Ah, Chike, my brother. <laughs> Thank you so much for your concern. But as you can see, I am happily married and very comfortable. And as for those kids, they are now my children. This one you went to adopt, honestly, I'm not interested. I don't need... Is she... Is it a girl or a boy? Uh, she, oh, is she? <laughs> I don't need her. I'm sorry. I'll just advise you one thing. Why not go and look for your wife? Let her come back home and take care of her responsibilities. Take care of you and your son. Or you, you get a nanny. And leave me alone. I am very okay where I am. I am happy in my marriage. And I have my own children now. Chike, leave me alone. No, don't all say this, please. Oh. You go, come to my house. I mean, this man, you know, Ada. Please give him a chance. This is it. Chike, this is it, right? All the stubbornness. And I don't, do, I, don't do, I don't know what to say to you. Now, what will you do with this child? Obviously, you're going to keep her. Yeah? You want to stand there? Let's go! Calm down, okay? Don't bring the child
condition uh, He make her a feel she bent Where's her girl? She can walk uh, I will never see you cry. 